Hello, everybody. How's it going? Welcome to the Secret of Monkey Island. Special edition, of course. It's 2022, after all. We're playing Monkey Island in 4K. It's absolutely stunning, as you can tell. High resolution graphics. The fonts are crispy as ever. I'm very excited. I've never played this game before, as the title suggests. I've heard many great things. It's just been one of those that has eluded me. So you were looking at the face of someone about to embark on a brand new adventure. And I'm and I'm looking I'm looking at chat and I'm thinking, you guys got a lot of cool jokes and cool references. And I just want to be included. <laughs> I just want to be part of it, you know? So uh, that's what we're gonna do today. Never played any of the Monkey Island games, none, zero, nada, zilch. And uh, we're gonna play, over the course of the next, well, five days, we're gonna play The Secret of Monkey Island, we're gonna play Monkey Island 2, and then on Monday, there's a brand new release, Return to Monkey Island, which is like, canon Monkey Island 3, to my understanding. Because it includes the original creator, I want to say Ron Gilbert. I think somebody in chat said Ron Gilbert. So uh, that's the plan. I'm very pumped about it. <laughs> I'm selling these fine leather jackets. Yeah, I'm sure that's a thing. Thing. I, that's probably a thing they say. I don't know, but I'm gonna find out. Okay. I'm glad you guys are excited. I'm glad you guys are excited. <laughs> because I don't know what to expect at all. Uh, some people said the humor's really good. Sometimes, uh, the, the logic behind solving puzzles can be a bit wonky. Sure, I'm gonna embrace it. I'm gonna embrace it. Uh, I have played some point and clicks on the channel before. I played through Siberia 1 and 2. And I played Dark Side Detective, which I would highly recommend. Outside of that, not a lot of, uh, professional experience with point and clicks. <laughs> uh, yeah, there is an option to switch the look. So if, if we look at the controls, here's one thing I'll be doing. It's uh, F10 to do this version hot swap. And uh, that's, I mean, yeah. You guys ready? Should we just get going here? <laughs> Back seating's gonna be insane on this one. Look. It's an old game. Uh, th I will get stuck from time to time. I'm sh I'm sure it's going to happen. Link that said, is essential. <laughs> that said, uh, try try to try to just hold back. If I'm stuck, instead of uh, telling me what to do, let me let me suffer a little bit. And if I get stuck, I'll definitely ask you. It's so we're playing the special editions. These are remakes that came out a couple years ago, uh, and they've been updated pretty heavily graphically. Uh, there's full voice acting and all this stuff, so yeah. Holy smokes, we're starting off some generous people. Holy smokes. Lord Star Kirby, thank you for this huge super chat, dude. What? That's wild. Skid Dog, thanks for the super chat as well. Great memories with this game, playing it as a kid. All I have to say is you fight like a dairy farmer. I, I'm sure that's a reference that I will at one point understand, and I'm really looking forward to it. <laughs> I'll really look forward to understanding this. Okay, guys, ready. <sighs> Let's focus up here, okay? We're gonna have a super time. Brand new game. Island of Melee or Melee. Yesterday we were playing 
a, a game with full metal music. <laughs> Two days in a row we've been playing like heavy metal music, killing demons, slaughtering them. This is pretty similar. I could argue. Is essential. Thank you, Hat and Hoodie. Thank you so much. <laughs> is this a flute or a recorder? Flute? Recorder? Streetwood, and I want to be a pirate. I Yikes. feel that. Don't sneak up on me like that. Um, I'm over this way. Ah, well then, Thriftweed. <laughs> Threepwood. Guybrush Threepwood. I see. So, you want to be a pirate, eh? You look more like a flooring inspector. But if you're serious about pirating, go talk to the pirate leaders. You'll find them in the scum bar. Gosh, thanks. I'll do that. Bye now. I'm off to seek my fortune. Just good like that. Luck. These tunes are bumping, hey? Um, this is good. Where did you say those pirate leaders were? Scum bar. The scum bar. Right. Thanks. You've got a worse memory than I do. Oh, okay. Part one, the three trials. <laughs> I love the flute, that's so good. Oh, so good. Okay. Um, really quickly, there is something in here called how to play, just so that we're all on the same page, all right? We're gonna move the cursor around with the mouse. Got it. Uh, move the cursor where you'd like Guybrush to go, left click on the mouse. Got it. Now there's this verb menu. You hit V or control to bring up the verb menu. And then you pick whatever type of thing you want to do here. Uh, with the verb selected, move the cursor over the object or person you wish to interact with and left click. Uh, there's a right click, which will allow you to use a default action with an object. What this is will be shown in the bottom right of the screen. Using the inventory menu, once you have an item in your inventory, you can pull up the inventory menu with the I or Alt key. Use the cursor to highlight different items in your inventory. If you want to combine items, first select a verb with the verb menu, then pull up the inventory menu. Use the cursor to highlight the item you wish to activate. Left click on the mouse to complete the action. Some items will allow you to use them with another item, either in the environment or in your inventory. This is very complex. If you're ever unsure of what to do in Monkey Island SE, you can bring up hints by pressing H. <laughs> I'll just ask you guys. These will start off being slight clues, and if you require further help, you can continue to press the H key for more and more detailed description of what you should do next. Got it. I'm an expert now. Okay. Am I in control? Looks like I'm in control. Let's walk to poster. Am I blocking... Oh, you know what? Let me, let me just... Look at- I'm just gonna... Boop. I'm just gonna bump that up a little bit so we can see underneath there. Let's look at this. Re-elect Governor Marley. When there's only one candidate, there's only one choice. Fair. Fair enough. Should I, uh, should we go back and talk to that old guy? No, let's go to Scumbar. I want to be a pirate. There it is. Can we go all the way down here? No. Impossible. What's up, Dennis? I could probably go ahead and unbind the H key. I did think about I did think about it. I'm just gonna like pull it off the keyboard so I don't have the temptation, you know? Alright. Let's go. <laughs> Freaking wild in here. That guy's definitely on the sauce. Can we just talk I don't to think anyone? It's wise to wake a sleeping pirate. <laughs> eh, 
kind of want to bother them. They're busy listening to the guy on the left. Can we pet the dog, though? Ahoy there, oh. stranger. I can talk to him. New in town. My name's Guy... I don't know if I have to say this. I think it's all voice acting. My name's Guybrush Threepwood. I'm new in town. Loving it. Guybrush Loving it. Threepwood? <laughs> That's the stupidest name I've ever heard. <laughs> I don't disagree. I don't disagree. Uh, how's the volume, chat? Are we good? Let me know. I don't know. I kind of like Guybrush. But it's not even a name. Well, what's your name? My name is Mancom Seepgood. <laughs> so, what brings you to Melee Island, anyway? And you want to talk about bad names? Bro. <laughs> Maybe turn down the flute. <laughs> Here, let's do this. I do think that I think we could turn the music down even a little bit more so we can hear the voices a bit. I want to be a pirate. Oh, really? You should go talk to the important-looking pirates in the next room. They're pretty much in charge around here. They can tell you where to go and what to do. He's got a marvelous beard, though. I will give him that. That is... If I could, if I could grow that... You better believe I would dedicate... If I knew that the outcome could be this, I would dedicate the year that it would take me to get there and just suffer through, like, the pain and agony and how much my wife would hate it to get to this. I would do it. Where can I find the governor? Governor Marley. Her mansion is on the other side of town. Okay. But pirates aren't as welcome around her place as they used to be. Can we switch it in chat, too? <laughs> oh, my God. That's the original <laughs> What the hell? Oh, that is pretty special. <laughs> I'd say slight improvement. Little bit. Why not? Well, the last time she had a pirate over for dinner, he fell in love with her. It's made things rather uncomfortable for everybody. How's that? Well, there's a whole big story about what happened next. But I don't believe a word of it. Esteban, over there at the other table, might tell you about it. Esteban. He takes the whole thing seriously. Very seriously. Uh-oh, looks like my grog is going flat. So you'll have to excuse me. Nice talking to you. Have fun on Melee Island. Melee Island. Uh, TM. <laughs> cool. Where I'm from, uh, Saskatchewan, there is a small town called Estevan. So, it's almost like it's meant to be. Can we pet this dog? That's going to be very important. What are you looking at me for? Whoa. I gotta see this guy. Oh, yeah. Okay. Who's this pirate that's bugging the governor? Who's this pirate that's bugging the governor? Lechuk. He's the guy that went to the governor's for dinner and never wanted to leave. He fell for her in a big way, but she told him to drop dead. So he did, and then... Things really got ugly. How did things get ugly? Lechuk was a fearsome pirate. He tried to impress the governor by sailing off to find the secret of Monkey Island. But a mysterious storm came up and sank his ship, leaving no survivors. We thought that that was the end of the fearsome pirate, Lechuk. We were wrong. The other eye is going to pop out here. What is the secret of Monkey Island? 
Maybe I think this we just win the game here. What is the secret of Monkey Island? Only LeChuck knows. Mm. He still sails the waters between here and Monkey Island. His ghost mm. ship is an unholy terror upon the sea. That is why we are all in here and not out pirating. I'd like to introduce myself. My name's Guybrush. Yeah? So what? <laughs> Does not care. Should we just be aggressive? Excuse me, but I'm looking for the dartboard. Dartboard? We don't have one anymore. There was a horrible accident. Oh. Drinking and darts don't mix. Maybe that's what happened. What happened to your eye? Well, I was putting in my contact lens when... <laughs> hey, wait a second. That is none of your business. We almost got him to let his guard down. Where can I get a drink? A drink? Hey, Carp, what's up, man? I could wait for the cook to notice you. But that would take all day. Just find the mug and sneak into the kitchen. That is what we all do. Okay. Look, uh... This whole LeChuck thing has me pretty shaken up. So, uh, if you don't mind. So a couple of these things are seemingly hints. Oh, I... You can talk to everybody. Ask me about Loom. <laughs> All right. So, tell me I'll about bite. Loom. You mean the latest masterpiece of fantasy storytelling from Lucasfilm's Brian Moriarty? Why, it's an extraordinary adventure with an interface of magic. Stunning, high-resolution 3D landscapes, sophisticated score and musical effects, not to mention the detailed animation and special effects, elegant point-and-click control of characters, Objects and magic spells <laughs> beat the rush <laughs> Go out and buy loom today. I'm sold. That's real, isn't it? Yeah, you guys are saying that's real <laughs> I love it I'm, I'm not even gonna I'm not even gonna call him on it. That was great. He sold me Thanks, hat. Oh <laughs> Okay, okay hi yourself Hi. Okay. Yeah, good chatting. Nice talking to you. Hi. <laughs> uh, okay. Dog, come on. Spiffy. Hmm, how do we reply? Let's give him a playful arf. Arf? Woof arf. Woof arf. Arf? Woof arf. <laughs> That's pretty good. Okay, uh the chuck. Look at that. So, the original not being voice acted, if we go out while they're talking, then <laughs> it's going to, like, fade that out. This is a really cool way of doing it, actually, where you can still play, basically, the original. This is so cool. Good dog. Spiffy. Good boy. Walk to Curtain. Look I don't at her. Anything special about it? <laughs> Me neither, buddy. What be ye wanting, boy? Uh, <laughs> Let's try not to die immediately. I want to be a pirate. So what? Why bother us? Hey, don't forget we're short on help because of this whole Chuck thing. So. 
So, no pirates means no swag, and no swag means no grog, and we're getting dangerously low on grog. You guys know what swag hmm. means? Do you have any special skills? I can hold my breath for 10 minutes. It's pretty good, well, actually. All right, but you don't become a pirate just by asking. You'll have to go through the three trials. Uh, what three trials are those? There are three trials every pirate must pass. You must master the sword and the art of thievery and the quest. The what? Treasure hunting, you sea urchin. Right! You must prove yourself in each of these three areas. Swordplay, thievery, and a, a treasure huntery. Easy. And return with proof that you've done it. This is like joining the Hell's Angels. Drink grog with us. Grog! <laughs> Bet you it tastes like ass. Okay. How do we master the sword? Tell me more about mastering the sword. First, get It's not what you think it is, chat. You must seek out and defeat the sword master. Someone in town can probably direct you. Oh! I want to find somebody to train you first. <laughs> Imagine trying to take on a sword master without any training. <laughs> <laughs> I should be taking notes, shouldn't I? Oh, I should be taking notes. Tell me more about mastering the art of thievery. We want you to procure a small item for us. The idol of many hands. In the governor's mansion. The governor keeps go. the idol of many hands in a display case in the mansion outside the town. You'll have to get past the guards, naturally. The tricky part will be getting past the dogs outside. Hey, they're a particularly vicious man. They might be able to drug him or something. Drug the dogs. That's my first note. Excellent. Pilfering the idol. Love that. Tell me more about treasure hunting. Legend has it that there's a treasure buried here on the island. All you must do is find the legendary lost treasure of Melee Island and bring it back here. Yeah, obviously easy since no Should one's I done it. Should I have a map or something? Well, you can hardly expect to find a treasure without a map. And don't forget, X marks the spot! <laughs> <laughs> okay, literally no help. Thanks, guys. What's in this grog stuff? What's in that grog stuff anyway? Grog is a secret mixture which contains one or more of the following. Kerosene, propylene glycol, artificial sweeteners, sulfuric acid, rum, acetone, red dye number two, scum, axle grease, battery acid, and or pepperoni, <laughs> as you can probably imagine. It's one of the most caustic, volatile substances known to man. <sighs> yeah, that'll put hair in your chest. Stuff eats right through these mugs, and the cook is losing a fortune replacing them. <laughs> <laughs> You're a bunch of foul-smelling, grog-swilling pigs. To be a pirate, you must also be a foul-smelling, grog-swilling... <laughs> Big. Okay. I'll just be running along now. Leave us to our drug. Good chatting. Come back later and tell us how you're doing. So these guys, I'm guessing, are the kind of our like touch point when we do these things. I need to sword train, steal that thing, and find treasure. No problem. I'll be back within the hour. Cozy. Oh yeah, cozy. Now they said something about getting a uh, a mug to get into the back. We could like fill hey, our own thing. You can't come back here. Oh, good chatting. 
Okay. I don't see anything special about it. Oh. Hey! Don't go into the kitchen! Okay. No. I'm in. I'm in. He left. So I'm in. See you later. I think that bird will peck my hand off. Is that right? Uh, okay. Well, how do I get rid of the bird? No. Nope. Can I give him the meat? It's some sort of meat or meat-like substance. <laughs> okay. Oh, there we go. There's pots underneath. Someone cooked a head cheese in this. I'm just gonna try and like pick up. Oh, yeah. I'm just picking up everything. Pot o stew. Is it this must be the grog barrel? I think it's full of that foul stuff pirates drink. Yeah, yum. This is great. Can I do like an open on this? It doesn't seem to open. Whatever. That doesn't seem to work. Okay. Let's see. Someone cooked a head cheese in this. Can I put this? Someone cooked a head cheese in this. It's boiling hot. Yes. Yes, it is. I, I see that. Yes, it is boiling hot. It's boiling hot. Hmm... Hmm. Can I? Let's see. Let's give. Oh, there we go. I see. Okay. Let's give the meat to the bird. No? Can I do a drop or something? Uh, no. You cannot do that. Okay. No, you cannot. In theory, I could just pick up the bird. You know? I could just pick up the bird and I could throw him away. And it would be fine, but no. No. Can I cover the bird with the pot? No, I cannot do that either. Okay. Let's let's figure <laughs> let's let's begin. Let's begin. I'm sure this will make total sense. Use hunk of meat with with fish? With barrel? With pot of stew? Okay, so we get these little, like, connections down there. That's cool. I'm into it. That doesn't seem to work. What if I, what if I throw Someone this? Someone cooked a head cheese in this. Hold on. Let's, let's, let's give pot. Nope, that's not gonna work. That is not gonna do it. See, none of these, like, bring up the other thing. Okay. Maybe I need something else. Let's look at the table. I don't see anything special about it. Yeah. Me neither, honestly. Me neither. Hmm. Okay. Look at... Is that something I do in here? Look at me with pot of stew, with table, with barrel. Oh, this it switches to use. That doesn't seem to work. I'm big braining, okay? I'm big braining right now. So <laughs> this is gonna this is gonna be great. Let's give the hunk of meat to nothing. Okay. Didn't want to do that anyway. Fine. Can I put it in here? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Okay. Now, can I get it back? Someone cooked a head cheese in this. 
use pot, maybe? With meat and stew? I don't want to put that in. No, do, wouldn't want to do that. Wouldn't want to do that. No, that would be... That would be impossible. You're saying this This is not... The puzzle's not fair? <laughs> Great. That's exactly the way I want to start this. <laughs> that is awesome. Okay. I'm cooking meat. Why? I don't know. It doesn't matter. But I'm cooking it. Okay? In, in, in my brain, I'm thinking, now, I've got the meat cooking. I need to then put it into the pot. And then, I would say, put the, put the, put the pot over there to get the bird to go to the pot with the meat. And then I can get the fish. I don't even know why I want the fish. I just know that I obviously need the fish. Okay? So that's what I'm, that's what I'm thinking. <laughs> Clearly, that's not working. That's not working. Use pot with the meat stew. I don't want to put that in. No, don't want to do that. Okay. What are we missing here? Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. So th this is like the plank stuck. Th okay. So I gotta, I gotta be clicking everywhere. Stuck. I gotta be clicking everywhere, all the time. I don't even know why I have the fish, but do I throw that in the stew as well? Possibly. Possibly. Look at. I think it's a herring. Fish. Mm hmm. Definitely. Uh, let's use the fish in the stew. I don't think it needs meat and fish. No. <laughs> why? Why would it? Why would it need meat and fish? That's that's a great question. I think it's a herring. What if I use the pot? with the fish. That doesn't seem to work. Okay. This is cool. Yeah. This is great. Uh... Okay. I'm looking for any other potential shenanigans. This is leading up to here, but I don't see that being very important. I can't interact with the fire. Let me check out here again. The plank stuck. The plank stuck. Is the plank? I think the plank is stuck. Okay, what if I someone cooked a head cheese? Put this. this on the table. That doesn't seem to work. No, that that would be stupid. Why would it ever do that? Okay, what about this? I don't want that much. He doesn't want that much. He doesn't want that much. Okay, we're gonna come back. I don't know. I don't know what else to do in here. I, I, I helped him cook in some meat, so, like, I feel as if my job here is, is done. Wait. Walk to door. Okay. If I want grog, I need a mug. So, let's go find a mug. A red herring? Yeah, I get it. I, it could be. Could be nothing. Could be nothing. Maybe it is. I don't see any free mugs about. Uh, maybe this guy's. But he. I, I don't even think I can go up there. Okay, you know what? Fine. I've had enough of this place. I'm gonna leave. We're coming back. Another time. Meanwhile. Deep oh. beneath Monkey Island, the ghost pirate LeChuck ship lies anchored in a river of lava. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. Oh, he's Captain cool. LeChuck, sir. I. Ah, there's nothing like the hot winds of hell blowing in your face. No, sir. Nothing like it. <laughs> yeah, I love the hot winds uh, of hell. Sir, I... It's days like this that make you glad to be dead. <laughs> oh, yes, sir. Glad to be dead. <laughs> we are glad to be dead, right? 
Oh, yes, sir. I, I feel so lucky that you happened to capture my ship, then murdered me and everyone on the board. Yes, yes, sir. Lucky. Glad to hear it. Now, what was it you disturbed me for? Uh, y yes, sir. Well, you see, we might have a problem on Melee Island. Problem? See, they're afraid to take a well, bath. There seems to be a new pirate in town. That's me. Actually, he's a pirate wannabe. Oh, that's definitely me. Young, inexperienced. Good looking. Probably nothing to worry about. Don't know why I bother you with it. <laughs> I'll have him taken care of myself. Wait! I'll handle this personally. My plans are too important to be messed up by amateurs. Yes, sir. Okay, so what do we know? We need to become better at sword fighting, thievery, treasure. Sword, I need to get training in town. Wrote that down because I'm a good planner. Thievery, I need to steal something from the mayor and I got to drug the dogs. That's what I got. And treasure was like, we need a map with an X or something. So, I mean, cool. I'm pretty sure we're on the right path. Look at Archway. Oh, hello. What's he selling? Definitely drugs. He's definitely selling drugs. He's definitely selling drugs. Excuse me, but do you have a cousin named Sven? Uh... What is that? Some sort of code? We blew it. Of course it's a code, you <laughs> idiot. Never mind. Cousin Good name's night. Sven. No, he's definitely selling drugs. What kind of drugs? Hard drugs? No, probably not. He looks like more of a recreational drug selling type. Marijuana? The devil's lettuce? Possibly. Excuse me, but do... Now it's only you again. <laughs> okay. Let's go into it. My cousin Sven sends his regards. I see. Let's talk business. <laughs> Are you serious? That's you want to buy a map to the legendary lost treasure of Melee Island? Bro, he's selling treasure maps? Only one in existence. Rare. Very rare. He literally showed me like five. Only 100 pieces of eight. Pieces of eight? I don't think I have any pieces of anything. Uh, no thanks. I don't have enough money. Well then, okay. buzz off, kid. It's bad for business. I need 100 pieces of eight, whatever those are. Good chatting. Let's see if he can give me any Excuse other me, info. But oh, it's only you again. Come back for the map to the legendary lost treasure of Melee Island, huh? I hope you brought enough money this time. Uh, I did not. Uh, no thanks. I don't have enough money. Well then, buzz off, kid. It's bad for business. <laughs> this is going well. <laughs> this is going well. Okay, let me check. What? Are, I've missed a door there. Let me check that. Also, better check out every corner here. Any of these cobblestones loose? Got a hundred... Pieces of eight sitting underneath? Yeah, I didn't think so. Oh, okay. Okay. Now, can I talk to, like, anyone that's walking through here? He's pretty quick. These guys I can. <laughs> what the f What is going on here? Okay, so they're like one-way or or two-way doors. At least they're consistent. Where's this one going to take me? It would like drop me in the ocean. What the? Hey, come here. Come here. Nope. All right, sick. Uh, go in here. Go in here. Oh, hello. What is this? 
I got chickens hanging from the ceiling. Chalice, bones, chickens, baskets. No thanks. I'd rather not touch any of this creepy voodoo stuff. What about some voodoo knickknacks? Uh, let's see. There's a jar of bat drippings, a box that says assorted scales, Guano. a shaker full of monkey flakes, and some cat knuckles. Cat knuckles? Oh, How that's what we think is weird? Yeah. That's that's the weird thing in that list. Mm-hmm. Poor chickens. Gee, I wonder what's in these baskets. Yeah, what if we, like... Oh. Hold on. Actually, I'm not that curious to find out what's inside. Probably poisonous snakes. Uh, I think I hear slithering inside. I think this all counts as... This is basket and baskets. Yeah. Interesting. Is that different? No thanks. Something would probably cool. jump out and bite me. Looks comfortable in a spooky sort of way. I love this. This is like... <laughs> this is really cool. You can press O to open? Oh, sick. Oh, okay, so hold on, hold on, hold on. That's that's cool. Open, use, pick up. Those I'll never remember. Close, look at, talk to, give. I can I can do a couple of those. Maybe over time things will change. I'm not gonna open the chicken. I'm going to look at the chicken. Hmm. A rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. What possible use could that have? Yeah. <laughs> pick. Pick up. Hmm. A rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. Oh, hold what on. What possible use could that have? I'm, I'm, I'm instinctually right-clicking. Don't want to be doing that. Don't want to be doing that. I'm going to break that habit. Maybe no one will miss just this one thing. All right. So that, that we're cool with. Poor little thing. Whatever it was. Can we pick up the bones? No, thanks. I'd rather not touch any of this creepy... Okay, fine. Stuff. We don't pick up creepy stuff. Fine. fine. Now this is the cup of a carpenter. The cup of a carpenter? No, thanks. I'd rather not touch any of this creepy voodoo stuff. Right. Oh, hello. What may I help you with, son? She just watched me, like, pilfer her wares. Let's be, let's be normal. Wait. As Don't normal as we anything. can be. I can sense your name is, is Guybrush. Guybrush knows hair. No, no. Threepwood. Guybrush Threepwood. Am I not she right? She is good. She is good. Wow, that was amazing. Mm -hmm. Do you know any other tricks? I do not deal in tricks. What I know is the truth. She has a, uh, like a bracelet or anklet, or oh, I thought I saw something weird there, or necklace on like every possible spot. That throws me off. Which chicken are we even talking about? Like all these hanging chickens? Ah. I sense the guilt of stealing my chicken grows. Oh shit! Take it. <laughs> oh, it's yours. The pulley. Th the pulley Why don't chicken. you want it? <laughs> Is it jinxed with an ancient voodoo curse? That's cool that she references no. that. No, the pulley squeaks. So. My mind reading skills tell me it is your future Busted. you are <laughs> interested in. You're right, Spooky. Are I you got certain Busted. this is something you really wish to know? Um This is one of those like philosophical life questions. If you could if you could know your future, would you want to know it? And would knowing your future then change your future? <sighs> I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to say yes. Yes, tell me everything that's going to happen to me. I am getting a vision. 
What the? I see you taking a long voyage. I see you captaining a ship. Good. Yeah. I see. What? See what? I see a giant monkey. Yikes. I see you inside the giant monkey. Gross. <laughs> Wait. It's all becoming clear. Well, that's good. Your journey will have many parts. You will see things better left unseen. You will hear things better left unheard. You will learn things better left unlearned. What kind of things? I hate surprises. No. The time is not right to know. When you know your purpose, come see me. I, I know my purpose. Know then. I'm writing that. Yikes! Oh, damn. When I know my purpose, see the chicken lady in town. Alright. There's really a lot of things he doesn't like or is scared of. Seems that way. Hey, I'm back and I'm ready to know more about the future. Guess no one's here. <laughs> okay, so we can't just like peruse over there. All right, fine. So what do I got now? I've got a fish. I think it's a herring. I've got whatever this thing is. L for look at. Hmm. A rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. Someone cooked a head cheese in this. And a pot. That I presumably am going to put something into one day. Right? You think I have a journal? Where? Where? I don't think I have a journal. Journal? 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 Don't think so. Don't think so. Okay, so these doors teleport me. I need a lot of money for this guy. Have we gone into this door? I have not. Ye old rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle shop. Serving your rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle needs for over 50 years. <laughs> okay. But we can't go in there. Maybe it's closed. It is pretty late. 10 o'clock. It's pretty late. I don't have the option to open that. Okay, let's talk to these people. Men of low moral fiber? <laughs> Alright. Let's go. Hey, don't mess with my rat. Yeah, okay. Hey, nice rat. <laughs> do you like rats? Do you, do you like rats? Well, I'm not going to threaten to eat his rat. Yes, I love rats. They're very intelligent creatures. <laughs> More intelligent than him. Why, there's a story around these parts that a bunch of rats actually crewed a ship here from fabled Monkey Island. No, that's not right. It was actually a group of monkeys. That's amazing. But true. <laughs> when they arrived, they sold the ship for a pretty penny. Only time I've seen anyone get the better of old Stan in a deal. <laughs> I thought it was rats. Do you guys know the sneaky looking man on the opposite corner? Wanna buy a map, eh? I do. Our maps are Oh, they quality. have maps too. Not like the bird caged liners you get from that clown across the street. <laughs> no, just kidding. <laughs> These are actually copies of the minutes of the last meeting of the Melee Island PTA. Can't even give them away. <laughs> Want one? Uh. No. 
No, but I'll take one if you give me two pieces of eight? Yeah, I'll take one if you give me money. No, but I'll take one if you give me two pieces of eight. Seems... Okay, that's fair. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> These guys are bad at their jobs. Say, are you guys pirates? No, we're a wandering circus. Scared away the elephant. <laughs> Shut up. Are these guys like a play of on Three Stooges? Of course we're pirates. You can't buy clothes like these off the rack. What do you want? I want money, mainly. What's in the keg? Rum. Jam. <laughs> jam. Uh, rum. <laughs> Uh, rum and jam. Yeah, it's the classic a combo. Favorite. Everybody knows that. Mm -hmm. I'm really interested in this pirating thing. What do you want? How come you're on this street corner and not on a ship? Looting, pillaging, sacking, that sort of thing. Well, pirating hasn't been panning out so well for us. There are some unnaturally talented pirates in the area right now. Operating out of Monkey Island. So we've been pursuing alternate means of self-support. We're trying to start up a circus. Oh, he wasn't joking. It was working out well until the rats scared off the elephant. Now you've depressed us. <laughs> Go home. Uh... I said don't pester the rat. I didn't even click it. I just looked. I'm not going to warn you again. Leave the rat alone. That's crazy. Like, I just hover on it and he gets all angry. Hey, man. <laughs> Frank, make him quit it. Oh, damn. Oh, now look what you did. Okay, I had a feeling we were onto something there. But what does that mean? To what does that mean for me? Do I have to go find the rat now? Where'd he go? Oh, he's gone. I'll offer him Excuse me, but the two pieces of eight. You again. It's the best I can do. Come back for the map for the legendary lost treasure of Melee Island, huh? That's me. I hope you brought enough money this time. Totally. God damn it. Uh, no thanks. <laughs> I don't have enough money. How well, many of this is giving you uh off, kid? It's bad for business. How many of you are getting, like, major nostalgia for this game? I feel like literally everyone in chat has played this game. Like, everyone. And... I'm sad. I'll just be running along now. Okay, well, I don't know uh, what's going on with the rat, but presumably... I don't know. We'll see what happens. Big time nostalgia? Major? How how does the how does the remaster compare for those that have only played the original? I'd be curious. Played all of them? I've had so many people reach out and say that they loved playing this, so. Oh. Okay, where the heck are we now? What what can I go into here? Is that a whisper or a leaky tire? <laughs> Oh, it's in a back alley. Okay, I'm gonna go in there. Let's go into the back alley where someone whisper pissing at Hello? us. Hello? Anybody in here? Oh, maybe this is where they tried to do this. Hello? Circus. You know, bad things could happen to a person in a dark, deserted alley like this one. And at this time of night, nobody would be around to see it. <laughs> That's interesting. <laughs> well, see ya. Now, why are you in such a hurry? <laughs> well, see ya. I'd better get your name. Um, yeah. So, I was just leaving. I'm Guybrush Threepwood, and I was just leaving. Listen, Peepwood. Threepwood. Guybrush Threepwood. Well, whatever your name is, listen. I'm the sheriff around here. Sheriff Fester Shinetop, take it from me. This is a bad time to be visiting Melee Island. A very bad time. My advice to you is to find somewhere else to take your vacation. 
somewhere safer. He's the sheriff? Boy, I feel much better knowing there's an officer of the law around. Yeah. I don't know about that, honestly. Okay. Uh, circus sign? Oh, a circus! I love a circus! Can I just take this? I can't pick that up. Yeah, no. Duh. <laughs> Obviously. Uh... Employees only. Sure. These have all the uh, little, like, skull icons on them. I can't pick up any of this. Can I go back in here? No. I can't look at this thing. Okay, so what am I doing back here? Was that just all a ploy to meet the sheriff? Perhaps it was. It I don't see anything special about it. Okay. Fine. Can I read the sign? Nope. Just like ripping myself into people's... Oh, he lives here? That's going to be very awkward. Ahoy there, fancy pants. Uh-huh. That's me. There's a lock on that door. Oh, that's a handle. Maybe it's not even locked. Shovels? Probably need that to dig up treasure. Eh? Chat? And you all thought I wouldn't know Let's how to go, play. Fancy Pants! Okay, yeah. Are you waiting for me to fall asleep or something? No. No, no. What do you no. want? Am I stabbed? Oh, nice! Swordmaster. I'm sword looking master. for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. The Swordmaster of Melee Island? Hmm. Now, I don't know. See, nobody knows the whereabouts of her secret hideout. Nobody except me. I'd have to go and ask her if it's okay to show you the way. Hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there. Once. Be right back. Once. Oh, he's got a peg leg. And don't touch anything! Yeah, right. Don't touch anything. Are you kidding me? Ring bell for service. I'm not going to ring that bell. I'm going to look Slash at this master. sword. When you want a sword as sharp as your wit. Please take. I'm very curious if there's, like, repercussions. I'm thinking no. <laughs> I'm just, yeah. Just steal everything. Yeah. I'm just taking, I'm just taking everything I can. No holds barred. Is that right? It just rotates. Uh, open? It doesn't seem to open. What? It doesn't seem to open. It doesn't seem to open. Does it have to be in the right position? It doesn't seem to open. It doesn't seem to open. It doesn't seem to open. It seemed like it did some kind of like, you know? Like that was a good, that was a good sign. Digmaster, the only shovel for serious treasure hunting yeah. enthusiasts. I mean, obviously I need that. Yoink. <laughs> Our pockets are just huge. Obviously wearing cargo pants. Can I go over here? Okay, what else can I mess with? Okay, well. Oh. Let's look at the safe. Davy Jones lockers. The last word in theft, fire, and grog resistant storage devices. The Davy Jones lockers. The last word in theft, fire, and grog resistant storage devices. Okay. Okay, let me try something. See, right there. Why is it doing that? Why is it doing that? Why is it doing that? It went all the way around the first time, and then it did that sound. Something's happening. And then if I go to open it... That's not what I meant to do. It doesn't seem to open. Hold on. Let me rotate this all the way again. 
it doesn't seem to open. And then if I do this, then it does the thing. Okay. So there's got to be some type of like... Some type of code going on here. Okay. 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 Now hold on a second. That's a pull. What if I then go to a push? And then it switches my default. Very interesting. Very interesting. None of them are giving like... I'm trying to see if any will give like a little click or something. <laughs> when we played... Uh, the Last of Us remake, somebody pointed out that you could, if you listen very closely as you rotate the dial, you would hear like a, a small click and that would tell you uh, that you've got the right number. But I'm not hearing any of that here, so I'm just, I'm just messing with it. Truly, this is the, is the dankest dungeon. <sighs> Thank you. <laughs> Glow, thanks for the 420. Wanted to pop in and say, I found you through your Horizon Zero Dawn and Witcher 3 series. You helped me relearn how to enjoy my time playing video games as an adult, immersing yourself instead of worrying about min-maxing. That's awesome. That is like the greatest compliment. Thank you. That's so cool. Thanks. It doesn't seem to open. No, it doesn't. Does it? It doesn't seem to open. Let's just give it a couple pushes for like good, good measure. All right. We'll come back. We'll come back. Should I ding this? I don't. I don't know. I don't. I don't know. Oh. Aha! Caught you, you little thief. Maybe you'd like to pay for those. I. Nope. I don't want to do that. <laughs> what? No, I'm just browsing. I think I'd just like to browse. Okay, but don't put your lips on anything. Not my lips. Promise. Okay, but what about the Swordmaster? What do you want? I'm looking for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. Look, I told you she doesn't want to see you. Maybe if you asked her again? Hmm... I guess I could hike all the way over there. Again. Be right back. Okay, let's go with them. And don't touch anything! No, I, there's nothing I could possibly touch in here anymore. <laughs> Looking for a sword master, are ya? Looking for a little five-finger <laughs> discount, it looks like to me. Do I have to put the See lens if back? I ever trust you again, devious little shoplifting weasel boy. <laughs> Maybe you'd like to pay what? for those. Okay, about the sword. About this sword. See, the thing yeah, is... what about it? I don't have any money. I want it. That's a hundred pieces of eight. A hundred? Take it or leave it. Okay. These prices are astronomical. I don't have enough money. Figures. Now how else do you want to waste my time? I gotta put them back? <laughs> about this shovel. Okay. Yeah, what about it? How much is it? Well, let's just I tell him. Oh, another would-be treasure hunter, eh? That'll cost you 75 pieces oh, of eight. Oh, well, that's cheap. 75 pieces of eight? I don't have that much. Then you better go put it back. I'm going to need to find the treasure before I find the item that gets me the treasure. This is a bit of a... It's a bit of a conundrum, if you will. Is there something here that maybe you can afford? Turns out, uh, no. I'm looking for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. Yeah, like I'm gonna fall for that one again. Oh, please. I won't steal anything this time, I promise. Hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there. Again. Be right back. 
see if he's messing with me this time. I guess not. I've got my eyes on you, weasel boy. <laughs> Don't try anything. <laughs> hey, chat, um, just a request. Um, basically, from now until forever, if you could refer to me only as weasel boy, that would be uh, preferred. Milo's anything special about it? Get just walk in there. Milo's anything special about it? There we go. Okay, he went past the drug dealer. <laughs> Whatever you say, fancy pants. Okay. Fair enough. <laughs> Maxim, thank you so much for the membership. I appreciate that, brother. Oh. He thinks he's sneaky, doesn't he? Little does he know. I'm a very quick clicker. That's what they called me in high school. Quick clicker. Not for reasons you think. <laughs> Speaking of high school. <laughs> in the mail, I got a, I got a, a, ma a package yesterday from my mom. Didn't tell me she was sending anything. So I just got this package, like this size, thin. And, uh... I'm like, this is intriguing. So I open it up. And it says, on the front, it says, My journal. <laughs> In, like, literally glitter writing. With, like, a transition of colors on it between, like, J-O-U to, like, the R-N-A-L part of journal. And, uh... Apparently, in grade 9, our teacher, for whatever class it happened to be, probably English, was, like had a bunch of questions and uh, that I needed to like answer and it was very uh, weird to read my thoughts which were honestly pretty blunt for grade 9 it was very weird <laughs> I'm gonna share I'm gonna share some of the some of the writing that I did on uh, I'll post it on Twitter and on Instagram, but that was a weird blast from the past. David Van Gorder, look at this. Gifting a membership to Celso. That is so cool. That's so cool. Thanks, man. Fork. Clearing, lights, house, island, mystery lights. Uh, okay. I don't... My, what an unusually bright I lost the guy! Man. Oh, I did pick one up. Okay. Is this unlimited inventory, by the way? Oh, look at this. Look at there the minutes. There sure are a lot of spelling errors. Great, helpful. It's a striking yellow color. Yes, yes it is. All right. I'm not going into this maze-like forest without a map or a guide or something. <laughs> Shit. Is it because I stopped? I'm not going into this maze-like forest without a map or a guide or something. What? Are you talking about, Guybrush? What am I doing out here, then? Go there. Or don't. Oh, are these... Are these the forks? Maybe? I'm not going into this maze-like forest without a map or a guide or something. So I'm coming out of there? But if I go in... What if I go in here? Same thing. 
And if I go in here? This island is full of trickery. Oh, okay. I totally lost our dude, man. I lost him. He's gone. I think there's something going on in there. Oh yeah? Maybe like a circus? I get in the cannon, but the gunpowder makes me sneeze. Well, I can do it. I hurt my hand taming the lions last week. I hardly think that little scratch compares to my chronic allergy. You get in the cannon. You don't have any allergies, you faker. You get <laughs> in the faker. cannon. No, you get in the cannon. No, you get in the cannon. Boys. Slacker. Loser. Raphael. Flop. Weasel. Why, Weasel? <laughs> that was weird. Miscreant. Toady. Ne'er do well. Scuffler. Mullet head. Millet head. Pencil head. Half head. Cheese head. We'll wait for them to finish. Harpy. What? Just to get in the cannon. No, you get in the cannon. No, you get in the cannon. Ah, your mama wears a combat slippers. <laughs> Leave our mother out of it. Get in the cannon. Our mother. No, you get in the cannon. No, you get in the cannon. You're a chicken. You're a dead chicken. Well, you're a dead chicken with a pulley in the middle. What? Just to get in the cannon. That's an insult? No, you get in the cannon. 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 Weasel. <laughs> Weevil. Miscreant. <gasps> Tony. Ne'er do well. Scuffler! I'm gonna, I'm gonna, head. I'm gonna step in. Minute head. Does this place? Say there, son. <laughs> how do you like the chance? A once in a lifetime chance. To perform an amazing feat. A death-defying feat. Well, not so death-defying, really. Uh, dangerous feat. No, not dangerous at all. An easy feat. But exciting. With the amazing. Adventurous. Acrobatic! And exceedingly well known! Fabulous! Flying! Ferrucini brothers! That's us! <laughs> my brother Alfredo! And my brother Bill! <laughs> Sound good? Good! It's very simple, really! Huh. Alfredo See that and Bill? Over there? All you have to do is uh, get in the cannon and we'll shoot you out of it! Across the room! Uh, quite safe, actually! So, what do you say? Oh! <laughs> I'll do anything for money right now. Let's go. How much will you pay me? How about 478 pieces of eight? Oh, I'm gonna die then. <laughs> that, that would pay for literally everything that we need. Plus more. What could go wrong? I'm in. Okay, sounds good. Have you got a helmet? Oh, God. Uh, no, I don't have a helmet. Will I need one? No helmet? Oh, you've got to have a helmet. Gonna need a helmet. Can't do the cannon trick without a helmet. Yeah, no, obviously. No, sorry. Oh! Go get a helmet and then we can do the trick. Wait. <laughs> okay, this is the way my brain thinks, okay? Don't laugh at me yet. But, could I wear the pot as a helmet? Could I do it? Use it on Guybrush. That doesn't seem to work. Nope. I thought that was... I thought it was onto something there. Okay? I thought... I thought that was the way. What else could I do? Oh, let me... Hold on. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let me... Let me... Let me... No. Let me go in. I can't move it. 
Weasel. Weasel. Weevil. I'm gonna say yes. Miscreant. I have a helmet. Tony. Ne'er do well. <clears throat> Guys. Do, oh, do we have to go through this? Again. Ready to do the cannon trick? I'm just gonna say yes. Have you got a helmet? Totally. Of course I have a helmet. What sort of idiot do you take me for? Well, let's have it. We want to be sure. That it's a safe. Wouldn't want you Come hurt. on. No sorry. This is totally gonna work. <laughs> ah, that will work as a helmet. Hmm. Let's now go. We can do the trick. Step right over here, son. Now, put on your helmet. Telling you guys. And the get in the cannon. I'm literally gonna blow you guys away with how genius I am, okay? That's Echo. my whole plan. Echo. Well, the helmet definitely worked. It works! Oh, I'm so relieved. <laughs> I have permanent brain damage. Hey! Are you okay? <laughs> I'm Bobbin. Sure. I'm Bobbin. Are you my mother? <laughs> He's all right. Hooray! We are spared an embarrassing and a financially debilitating lawsuit. Here is your money, sir. Just a recompense for aiding us. That's sick. We're literally the loaded. Is fine. We just need to change the aim a bit. I'll try it next. No, I'll do it next. Oh, no, God. me! No, me! Slacker! Loser! Ruffian! Fop! Thank Christ. <laughs> 480! You guys. Oof. We're rich! That's incredible. That's... Dream come true. I don't see anything special about it. Just go there. Okay, so... I guess I'm gonna go back to the village and buy the stuff. And then... I'll buy the stuff. We'll see if he wants to go out again. And I won't dilly-dally next time telling you about my grade 9 journal. And we'll try and follow him. Okay? That's the plan. It's a pretty good plan. <laughs> I think it's pretty good anyway. Lubricant is essential. Is that right? David! Man, thank you so much, dude. I appreciate that. Thanks for the super chat, David. Hope you're doing well, man. Hey, chat, gotta say you guys are doing well, great. special about it. You're doing great on not... Not, uh, spoiling stuff. And, uh, being patient. And all of that, all of that good stuff. You're doing, you're doing great. Excuse me, but the... Now oh, it's only you again. Come back for the map to the legendary lost treasure of Melee Island, huh? I hope you brought enough money this time. I'll take it. I'll take it. It'll make a swell gift. We should be haggling. There you go. You made a wise decision. Now get lost. If there's one thing I know about people with trench coats, they love to haggle. And I could have got that for cheaper. But this is not meant to be. Said lubricant is essential. Haven't heard that in a long time. Yeah, I was... Doing a little, doing a little Subnautica throwback there. Hey, where'd you go? I hike halfway <laughs> across the island to try and get you a reservation with the Swordmaster, who, by the way, says you can go jump in the lake. And when I come back, whew, you're gone. Sorry, man. See if I ever do you a favor again, ungrateful little shoplifter. I'm here with hard-earned cash. Okay, check this out. I want to buy this shovel with from you. What was it? 75? This sword too. I want it. 
Let's go, fancy pants. If you're thinking about stealing something, think again. I'm doing it right in front of you this time. What do you want? About this sword. Yeah, what about it? I want it. Great. Best hundred pieces of eight you ever spent. You got it. What else do you want? The shovel? About this shovel. Yeah, what about it? <laughs> Let's go, fancy pants. <laughs> I want it. Great. I hope he sticks around oh, the entire it'll game. It'll pay for itself, believe me. Yeah, you'll dig up 75 pieces of eight in no time. But hey, save true. some treasure for the rest of us, would you? <laughs> what else do you want? He loves me now. I'm looking for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. Yeah, like I'm gonna fall for that one again. Oh no. Oh, please. I won't steal anything this time, I promise. There's nothing left to steal, I dude. Yes, I could hike all the way over there again. Be right back. I've got my eyes on you, Weasel Boy. Don't try anything. <laughs> Just love when he calls me Weasel Boy. It's so endearing. Okay. Let's cruise. I'm not losing him this time. Come on. Lubricant is essential. Dennis! Dude, thanks, man. Thanks for the super chat. Sure brings back memories. Looks better, though, yeah. Yeah, I, I I don't have the memories, but it does look good. Like, it's it's really well done. Yeah, it's cool. Oh, am I, am I actually, like... Is this, like, an actually timed deal? Like... Uh, did I lose him again? No. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay. I found him. Ah, okay. Now we're good. We're good. We're good. Nice try, Dennis. Nice try. I see what you're trying to do. I see. Better pick these up. I don't think strolling through the forest picking okay. flowers is very good practice for being a pirate. What? So we'll pick up yellow flowers, but red, no. We draw the line. What is this area he's taking me to? You know what? Just let's just go. I don't need to look at the sign. That was actually I a little just stressful. Stay back here and eavesdrop. Hello again, Carla. I thought I told you to get lost. Actually, I'm here on the business. This kid come into my store, see? <laughs> Face it, you crusty old lech. You'd make any excuse just to come out here and bother me. Yeah, I guess so. Well, cut it out. I'm sick of it. Take a hike and don't come out here again. Someone might follow you, and then I'd become another Melee Island tourist attraction. Hey, it's your loss, baby. <laughs> yeah, right. Now scram. It's your loss, baby. Well, here goes nothing. Please train me. How dare you approach the sword master without permission, which I surely didn't give you. She's angry. <laughs> why, why do I keep offering to sell jackets? What is this? What, what? It was with the the Ringling Brothers. I had that option. I don't want to piss her off, so I'm just going to be honest. I beg your pardon. I'm gonna I have to sell to something jackety to I someone. Doubt that. 
everyone who comes here is prepared to fight. Let's be honest. You're here to prove yourself to the pirate leaders. Oh, Indiana in hopes Jones. Of one day being as immoral as they are. <sighs> yep. Classic. Nailed it right on the head. Gee, you're smart. What was your final grade in Captain Smirk's sword fighting class? A plus. Uh, uh, be honest. Grade? Class? You mean you came here to take on the sword master of Melee Island, possibly the greatest sword fighter in the entire Caribbean, without a single lesson in the art of fencing? Yep. <laughs> How did you expect to defend yourself? Gee, I don't know. I see. Obviously not with your razor-sharp wit. I'd advise you to seek out Captain Smirks and get some real training. Where's he? It would he? hardly be ethical, sporting, or even interesting to fight someone as unskilled as yourself. So beat it. Okay, Captain Smirks. Can I ask her? Hey, goats. Thanks for the 17 months. You're selling fine leather jackets. Is that right? Wow. How dare you approach the Swordmaster with... Wow. Oh, it's you again. Hi, I'm selling these fine leather jackets. <laughs> Do you have one in size three? It's of not, course you don't. Not what I expected. Because you're not really a jacket salesman. Let's be honest. You're here to prove yourself to the pirate leaders in hopes of one day being as immoral as they are. Yep. Nailed it right on the head. Gee, you're smart. I told you, I'm not going to fight you until you get some training. Fine. He went this way. Can I also go this way? Nope. Guess we take the long way home. Looking for anything else. Okay, not bad. Uh, we did learn something there. We need to find Captain Smirks. Aye, oh, this better be important. I don't have a clue who that is. Nice night we're having, isn't it? Oh, I sure hopes you had something more important to stop me for. Why do you guys talk so funny? Pirate lingo. It's how everybody talked back then. Come on, guy brush, play along. Oh, he's role playing. Sorry to bother you. I'll uh, be on my way. What? Lubricant is essential. Ugly pirates. Hey, go talk to the ugly pirate. Bro, what? <laughs> Fabio. Dude, thank you so much, man. Dirty, rotten pirate. I can't catch these people. Oh, okay. There's the sword master. Shore, island, house, lights. Okay, I need to find Captain Smirks. And I have no clue where he's at. But there were still some other areas in here that we didn't see. This guy looks chill. Sell him a jacket. I mean, if I get to sell one, that would be that would be just great. I appreciate that, man. Thank you, dude. Pronunciation that's most accurate to the words origin and most respectful to the natives is Caribbean. Car Caribbean. How much money do I have? Two hundred and five pieces of eight. It's still 11 o'clock, or whatever time it was. Seems like it's always 10 o'clock on this <laughs> island. <laughs> That's awesome that he says that. That's really cool. That's, I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, what's this? I'm, I'm thinking church. I'm thinking church. Oh, oh thanks. Okay. Who who are all these people? It's a church. Okay. What can I do in here? Great question. 
Confessional booth? Yes, please. That would be sick. Cool. I have walk to exit. Oh, uh, also walk to exit. Let's just look over here. That's good. Maybe I need to come back when there's like a service. I need to be here during another time. Because there's literally nothing happening here. Okay. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. What's this place? Looks like a prison. I don't see anything special about it. <laughs> I am bang on with my building identifying skills. Oh, the rat! Is that the same rat? Hey, little guy. It's locked. Really? Obviously it's locked, bro. I can't talk to the rat it's or locked. anything. You gotta get me out of here! I'm a victim of society! Not to mention halitosis. <laughs> you think the service is 11 p.m.? Maybe. Hey, it's hard to keep my breath minty fresh when there's nothing to eat in here but rats. Oh, so that's food next to you. Interesting. What can I look at here? Absolutely nothing. Go back in. I don't see anything special about it. Just inside, thanks. I didn't even look at our map that we got. Just realized. I, I That's bad. When I play games where I have to, like, I, I get something, but it just goes into your inventory and you don't get to, you don't automatically look at it, then I will miss out. Too late. This hand. is that's hilarious. The map? Dungeon. It looks like dancing lessons. What? War paint. <laughs> okay. First of all, I opened the map and I heard the sound and I was like, damn, that is awesome. Thank you, man. It has been a long time. Long time Twitch sub who now only rarely manages to catch your streams. Thanks for continuing content. Currently watching your Forbidden West playthrough and loving it. Thanks, man. That's awesome. I've, I ha Honestly, I'm t up until last week, I hadn't been streaming very much at all, but I, I've really been digging it. So, yeah, very cool. Um... So this is not, this, is, this could be a map. This is clearly some type of, like, code situation happening here. But the question is, what's with the different colored steps, for one? And, and, and what's this? Back, two, three, four, left, two, three, four, right, two, three, four. Left, two, three, four, right, two, three, four, back, two, three, four, right. This could be the safe combination, but what's throwing me is the backs. Because uh, we were messing with that handle. So, like, left, I would say, like, a pull. Right would be, like, a push. Back would be, like, an open, maybe? But uh, that, could be a, that could be a stretch. That could, that could be a stretch. Yeah, what if we just open the lock? Sure. It's locked. <laughs> Can I use... What if we just... Um, what if we just use the shuffle? I don't think that'll open it. No, I don't think so either. But you never know, okay? You never know. Um, okay. 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 So I can't interact with the rat at all. I don't want anything but oh, my freedom. I thought it actually worked. And maybe a breath mint. Oh damn! I thought that actually worked. Okay, he wants freedom. I mean, I, I don't think I'm getting much done in here. Okay. That doesn't seem to work. Excuse me. Use sword. That doesn't seem to work. All right, fine. 
I'll do one more stupid thing. I don't think that'll open it. No. All right. He wants out. I don't know. I don't think I have anything to, to go on in here. Let's go somewhere else. I need to advance time, I think. Somehow. Oh. Oh. Okay, so this is where I gotta pilfer the thing. Steal the item from here. I gotta drug the dogs. I gotta drug the dogs. Just goddamn horrible. Deadly piranha poodles. <laughs> I don't think I can get past them. I mean, to be fair, they are tied up. Piranha poodles don't eat fish. I mean... T it, technically, if you think about it, piranhas would eat other fish. So, it was a pretty decent attempt. Piranha poodles don't eat fish. Could it be that my flowers are poisonous? I don't think these dogs are vegetarians. Cool. This was fun. See ya. Okay, so maybe what I'm going to do... Captain Smirks, who the frick is that? Maybe I'll go back to um, the bar. Scum. And uh, I'll, I'll go and be like, hey, pirate guys, uh, what's up? How are things? This is what I've been up to, and they'll be like, yeah, now you should do this. And I'm going to be like, okay, hey, cool, That's that sounds awesome. That's my plan. Let's see if there's anything new with these guys, or anything... No, nothing. I'll just be running along now. Okay, so the only other thing I have to work off is this map, which is clearly not a map. So, we, I could try messing with the safe. Let me see something here. Let's give them this map. Nope. Let's, let's maybe confront this guy. Be like, hey, dude. I wanted a map. And this is not that. Nope. Okay. This is going well. This is going well. This is not the place. We can see if she's here. I doubt it, though. Hello? Guess no one's here. I've done my part. Uh, is it this place? It is not. Oh, yeah, it's back here. Old games never tell you what to do. Yeah, I think they hint at us. They hint at us. Um, but I don't remember what she said about if she, if she said hey, where where'd you go? Where the guy I is. I hike halfway across the island to try and get you a reservation with the swordmaster, who, by the way, says you can go jump in the lake. And when I come back, whew, you're gone. See if I ever do you a favor again, ungrateful little shoplifter. You still angry, eh? What do you want? Got it. <laughs> the breath mint for the prisoner. I could really use a breath mint. Whew, you're telling me. Here, take one. <sighs> Please. Okay. Take We're on to something. Roll. We're on to something. That'll be one piece of eight. I can afford that. What else do you want? Uh. I'm looking for the sword. I'm curious to see what he island. says here. Yeah, like I'm gonna fall for that one again. Fair. Oh, please. I won't steal anything this time, I promise. Hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there again. Be right back. So, uh, hmm. I've got my eyes on you, weasel boy. Don't try anything. Maybe, maybe I'm doing this not necessarily to follow him, but that gets me access to this. <laughs> I think this is a this is a this is a long shot. Breathmaster for the pirate who cares about first impressions. 
This is a, this is a this is a pretty big long shot, but whatever. Okay, I'm gonna just write this down. Okay, back left right. Oh, I just had a thought. Back left right. Left right back. Right, left, back. Okay. Um, when we were in that small section of the uh, forest, and I think, did it say, I won't do this without a map or a guide? And we were, it was like kind of going in circles. That's probably... That's probably where this is. That's probably what this is for. However, however, I'm also curious to try it here. Um, so I'm going to do... <laughs> how do I do back, though? That's the stupid part. I don't have a back. I, I The only thing I have is, like, I feel like an open would be back. It doesn't seem to open. Yeah, this is dumb. This is not going to be right. <laughs> Uh, okay, I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna waste my time here. I, I think, I think it's probably that little section in the woods. I'm gonna focus on that. But for now, let's go give a breath mint, because, obviously, it's my top priority. I don't see anything Helping special about it. Helping this random prisoner I know nothing about. Oh, maybe he's the guy. Maybe he's Captain Smirks. Could it be? Could it be? Uh, I don't want to use the prisoner. No, uh, that's a different game. Let's give him a breath mint. Oh, Grago mint. Yeah, man. How refreshing. Defo. Thanks. So, have you come to release me? Um, let's start with your name. Who are you? Smirks, please be Smirks. My name is Otis. Otis yes, Smirks? I think it is. I've been in here so long I can hardly remember. It's not a good sign. You gotta get me out of here before I lose my mind completely. Can't you see? I'm innocent. But why are you in jail if you're innocent? I was framed. I didn't touch the stupid flowers. We have flowers. Please be yellow. What flowers? The jello conish in dormi flowers in the forest. It's against the law to pick them. Mm-hmm. Oh. Well, that's probably bad then. It's against the law to pick them. So, uh, how's the hood in there? Great. Oh, you know, the usual. Slop, grog, gruel, rats, bugs, and body lice if I can catch them. So I have a carrot cake my Aunt Tilly made, even though she knows I detest carrot cake. Actually, the cookie at the bar is an old friend of mine, and sometimes he sneaks me food, like pork trimmings, mostly feet and lips. But once in a while, he brings this really odd rump roast. Oh, we left that, we left that, we left that beef in the thing. What was so odd about the rump roast? Well, it's the only rump roast I ever seen with a prehensile tail. Hmm. Who'd want to frame you? So who'd want to frame you? I don't know who exactly. I think it was a conspiracy. Right. And if there's one type of piracy I don't like, it's Cole's piracy. Right. Sheriff Shine Top sure is a jerk, isn't he? No kidding. Fester Shine Top is the meanest man on Melee Island. Great Luckily, name, though. the governor keeps him in check most of the time. We used to have a fair, decent man for a sheriff, but he recently died under mysterious circumstances. If you ask me, I think the new sheriff had something to do with it. I think oh. you've said enough, Otis. Whoops. Okay. I hope you haven't been taking this filthy vagrant too seriously. 
He'd say anything to avoid paying his debt to society. Okay, here's where my mind is. Let me just explain what I'm thinking because you don't know. I'm thinking I need to get into jail with him. And the way I would do that is be like, hey, bro, I got these illegal yellow flowers from the woods. And then he's like, you can't do that. Straight to jail. And then I'm in there, but, <laughs> but then what? That's the that's the downside. I don't have a I don't have like an afterthought to that. I just think maybe I could get in there. It would also be great to maybe get the thing that I put in the stew. Cause he was talking about that, it seems. But I also would love to have like a key and be able to get out of here. He seems innocent to me. That's Why don't you I'm let thinking. him out? Maybe you should mind your own business, stranger. I'll decide who's innocent and who's guilty around here. Sorry. Look, I don't know what you're up to. But whatever it is, it's probably illegal. Yeah, so forget that's true. it. Oh, okay, well that did... Wherever you go on melee, I'll be watching. And if you try any monkey business, You'll end up in here for good. Man, is he a pill or what? You see what I have to put up with? You better go before you get his body in trouble. Now... He said if, if you... Do any monkey business, you'll be in here. So maybe this says do the monkey. Maybe if I do that, then I get into jail. I feel like I'm gonna be in jail. <laughs> That's what I feel like. Let let's give him these flowers, maybe. I don't want anything but my freedom. Okay, well, it's been fun, Otis. Good luck. See you later. Okay, so I am gonna... I am going to... I'm gonna go to the forest. And in that little trickery there, I'm gonna try and follow our, our map uh, path and see what happens. Because uh, I got nothing else to try. Oh, let me actually go back in here for a second. Everyone's still chilling. Can wait for this guy to come out, maybe? Well, if this is the boy who wants to be a pirate, how do you fare on your I'm wondering if they could tell me where the sword trainer guy is. Tell me again about mastering the sword. You must seek out and defeat the sword master. I've done one Someone of those steps. Someone in town can probably direct you. And get yourself trained first. Cool. They're, I'll just yeah. be running along now. Awesome. So helpful. Cool. Leave us to our grog. Okay, bye Come now. Come back later and tell us how you're doing. That's what I was trying. <laughs> hey! You can't come back here. Cozy. Let's just like uh, give him a second, see if he comes out. Oh, sick, right on cue. <laughs> and seal it. Okay. Potto stew. Hmm. Stewed meat. Hmm. Yes. Oh, I still have breath mints. Breath master for the pirate who cares about first impressions. Can I pick this up now? Ow! Got it. I guess so. Stewed meat. It's some sort of meat or meat-like substance. Okay. 
Okay. Uh. It doesn't seem to open. Open? No. I can't move it. I'm curious. It's boiling hot. It's boiling hot. Okay, we're out. We did get the meat, though, so maybe I could take that back to the prisoner, because he was... He was talking about that. Let, let me out? Oh, there we go. I'm going to start with that. We'll see what happens. So back into town we go. I don't want anything but my freedom. Okay, back to my f other plan. Back to my other plan. I'm going to go into the mystery forest. We're going to try this little uh back left we're going to try this little back left right left right back right left back. B A B A start. And we'll see. We'll see. I want to say we referenced a map. This game brings back memories. Good ones. It seems like... I, I honestly don't think people have said a bad thing about it. Other than, like, some of the uh, puzzles can be a bit, like, illogical. Which I think is, is fair. Should I talk to this dude? <laughs> uh yeah okay i heard there was gonna be a weenie roast here yikes <gasps> oh you almost scared me to death i thought you were a oh never mind hey, what did you say your name was again you don't remember <laughs> call me squinky call me squinky okay squinky Oh. Actually, my name is Guybrush Threepwood. I came to Melee Island because I want to be a pirate. Well, you picked the right place for it. Though perhaps the wrong time. <laughs> Not to mention the wrong name. <laughs> you have the silliest name I've heard in a long time. It's the only one I've ever heard that was more ridiculous than Squinky. I'm over this way. Huh? He's blind as a uh, bat. Who are you? I'm the lookout of Melee Island. I watch the ocean for approaching storms and ships and report them directly to the governor. She doesn't like unexpected visitors, especially not now. Why is the governor worried about unexpected visitors? <laughs> Change my name to Weasel Boy. Actually, I it's the it. expected visitors we're worried about. One pirate captain in particular. A dead one, Le but Chuck. that doesn't make him any less dangerous. How did you get to be the lookout when they you actually said blind, blind as a bat? A bat. Goddamn. I'm Watch your tongue. I was handpicked by Sheriff Shinetop. Is that right? I'll just be off to seek my fortune now. Good luck! Okay. What was I doing out here? Oh yeah. The fork. Okay. Oh, shit. I already have a problem. This could be back, I guess. Yeah, back. Back 
Left. Right. Come on. So back. Left. Please work. This is good. This is good. This is good. Right. Left, right, back. Ooh, uh, I'm not going to stop. Oh, we're definitely onto something. Left, right. And there's got to be a back. Yep. And then I got right, left, back. Okay, let me, let me, let me, hold on, let me look at this. What a lovely plant. I can't pick that up. No, obviously. <laughs> Duh. Uh, right. Left. Back. And this has got to be the secret to Monkey Island. Holy shit, it is somewhere cool, but what is it? What? Oh, okay, 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 okay. There's a plaque. The legendary lost treasure of Melee Island. <laughs> this carefully reproduced piece of Melee Island history has delighted thousands of would-be pirates and their families for generations. Reproduced? Remember, there are other pirates on this island. So go easy on the treasure. Leave some for the next person. You're shitting me. There's the X. Here lies treasure of such unimaginable wealth. Well, you'll just have to dig it up to believe it. Paid for by the Melee Island Chamber of Commerce. <laughs> well, hey. We're making progress, right? I think we're doing actually pretty well. Use shovel. Well, this shouldn't take too long. There's gonna be nothing in here. Hours pass. Nice. It's not gonna be ten anymore. Hey, I think I hit something. It's probably rocks. Oh boy. It's a t-shirt. <laughs> not my size, but a nice one nonetheless. What? Well, I guess I should put all this dirt back now. What am I going to do with that? More hours pass. Okay, we're hitting like... Well, it's not morning. So... What's the t-shirt? I found the treasure of Melee Island and all I got was this stupid t-shirt. I swear to God. I swear to God. I'm gonna go show those pirates this, and they're just gonna... I'm gonna be embarrassed is what's gonna happen. That's what's gonna happen. Come on now. I wonder if it's still 10? Yeah, I, I wonder too. Because the moon is still out. I don't know if the moon was higher or lower. Maybe that could be a thing. But it did literally say hours passed. Anyways, I'm going to show him. Hey, I'm capable of following instructions. I found the treasure. It's shared. But it's something. I thought that would be the last thing that we would end up finding. Quest. Like, that would be the last of the quests. Here's the treasure. I found your legendary lost treasure. Well, I discovered the lost treasure, eh? You're a clever boy. You may keep the chic t-shirt. We have plenty. That's it? I'll just be running along now. Leave us to our drug. Come back later and tell us how you're doing. Okay. 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 
I thought I would get like a lead or something. Let's go check the time. Let's go check the time. We'll go back into town. It's still looking pretty dark. Oh, God, what? Time is an illusion on this island, I think. Son of a bitch. Seems like it's always 10 o'clock on this island. Yeah! Okay. So. I have no leads on Captain Smirks. This map now is basically useless, I think, right? So that's probably good. I've got the chicken pulley thing, and there's a store that apparently sells those, but it's closed. Or at least their door is not accessible. I've got money with nowhere to spend it. I've got meat that the prisoner doesn't want, although he did talk about meat. I've got the fish. I have the minutes. We looked at this, did we not? Well, maybe well, I sure didn't. There are a lot of spelling errors. Oh, yeah, spelling errors. Which literally helps me not at all. The guy talked about having f the uh, picking yellow flowers was illegal. Uh, the map, the shovel, the sword, which presumably I'm going to need when I find Captain Smirks. The breath mints for who the hell knows what. And now I have this sick t-shirt as well. Let me, uh, actually, let me talk to this guy. Excuse me, but do... Well, Sir. it's only you again. I told you there was only one in existence. Nugget lost. Okay. Can I, like, give him anything? What if I give him this t-shirt? Like, here you go, man. Nope. Okay. Okay. So, we know... What else do we know? What else do we know? Oh, maybe I could go... Hold on. Let me go back to the voodoo lady here. And let's see if we can call out to her. Because we did do something, you know. Maybe she'll be like, Oh, yeah, here's your future. You're going to fight a sword guy. Hey, I'm back and I'm ready to know more about the future. Guess no one's here. Shit. Okay. Okay. So then we have the mansion with the dogs. And we need to drug them. We know that. That's good. <laughs> I guess. Uh, oh, hold on a second. Well, that went well. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, I have an idea. I have an idea. There's the, uh, in the kitchen, we've got the little, um, We've got the little, uh, poison symbol. I, I think it's Grog. But it's made up of all, like, the battery acid or whatever. They obviously eat the meat. I guess, okay, meat, piranha, piranha meat. Yep, got it, cool. Uh, the question is, can I... Is there gonna be more stew? Uh, must be, right? It gotta be. I'm gonna grab stew. I'm gonna... I'm going to, uh... See if I can pour the, the grog on it. And then feed it to the dogs. It's gotta be it. 
Let's just wait for this dude to come out. Hey! You can't come back here! If that doesn't work, how else could I drug them? I could overdose them on uh, breath mints, is what I could do. Or maybe the flower, actually. Maybe the flower as well. Hey, what? That was so fast! <laughs> His walk is so good. Hey! You can't come back here! Don't mind me. Just looking at the fireplace. Cozy. Hey! Oh god, he called me right go away. Into the kitchen. Yeah, okay, well then just spend a little bit more time over there. Thanks. Okay, so it's like a whole other, uh, it's a new chunk of meat. Pick up. Uh, what's put? No. Uh. Oh, use. Do I need to do that? What if I use it here? That doesn't seem to work. So maybe I, okay, maybe I do need to cook it. Use this here. Then take Ow. it. Got it. Then come on. This has gotta be it. Use this with the barrel? That doesn't seem to work. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on a second. Is there another verb? I think it's full of that foul stuff pirates drink. Like, it's clearly got the poison stuff on there, right? I feel like we're close. Feels like we're close. Uh... We don't know anything about these. It's a striking yellow color. <laughs> I don't think they're- I don't think they're poisonous. Uh, how do I combine items again? Combine items in your inventory. Use pot with meat? Did we do that? Wait. Highlight the item you wish to activate and left click on the. Mo okay, hold on. If you wish to combine, first select a verb and then pull up the inventory. Use the cursor to highlight the item you wish to activate and left click on the mouse to complete the action. Sometimes we'll be allowed to use them with another item, either in the environment or blah, 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 blah. Okay. Use meat with condiment? Oh, that's condiment. That doesn't seem to work. Do I need to get my pot back, maybe, from the circus? Is that possible? Is that possible? That doesn't seem to work. Let me, let me run out to the circus. Let me see if I can get that pot back. Because maybe I need, like, a, a vessel... And it is in the thing. No, I'm not actually asking Celso. Not yet. Not yet. I'm going to try to figure it out. I'm going to try to figure it out. No, I'm not actually asking. I'm, I'm trying to... When I get really stuck like this, I'm trying not to look at chat too much. Only because I don't want to have it, like, accidentally spoiled. Oh, this is not where I want to go, dude. This is not where the circus is. Let's go. I didn't... <laughs> See the pot there um, when we were inside after the pot flew off our head. But also, there's spots on the map we haven't even gone to yet. So maybe I should just check those and see what happens. Because that probably, that's probably what I should have been doing. That's probably what I should do. 
So we'll check the circus, but then we'll check out the other sections of the map. Or of the, the paths, I should say. And see what happens. Like light, house, island, sword master, doesn't matter. We'll give it a shot. Oh, I'm loving it, Luckless. Yeah, this is awesome, dude. I'm having a super good time. It's fun as hell. The writing's really good. Yeah, it's cool. Those crazy Spaghetti Brothers are still in there. I love the Spaghetti Brothers. I think there's something going on in there. Those crazy Spaghetti Brothers are still in there. Those crazy Spaghetti okay, Brothers Okay, so we can't go in there. there. Okay, Those so now I'm, I'm going to check out the other places. In there. there was a hint system. Yeah, exactly. I talked to chat at the beginning saying, like, I'll probably just ask chat, but... The hint system seems like it layers or something. Uh, it starts you basic and then kind of advances. But I'm going to check out these other things that I've never seen yet. So let's actually go to shore first. Oh, stinking pirate. Maybe I can give him a breath mint. He's gone. Hold on. Okay. Because they were dirty rotten before. Now they're stinking. So I'm going to try a breath mint maybe. Uh, hello? Hello? Oh, okay. Well, never mind. I ran into that one sketchy pirate. I thought I clicked on him, but maybe it was just the thing. Okay. Hook Island. Restrooms. Souvenirs. Gaudy, but in a cheerful sort of way. There's a cable. Looks like I'm... Oh. Oh. Okay. It's just like the one on the other side. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. What would you need on a cable? You're going to need a pulley. But my pulley squeaks. Is it defective? Good question, Guado. It is not defective. I was thinking because there was, like, that pulley shop that we needed to, like, repair the pulley or something. No. Our pulley is just fine. It. You can't reach it. Sorry, what? I can't reach it. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Anyway. Okay, so what is this place? Please be awesome. Okay. Hey! Hooks for hands. I don't like visitors. Who are you? <laughs> uh, it said there were restrooms here. Uh, excuse me, but the sign said there were restrooms in here. Sorry, but that sign's a little out of date. I used to have a thriving tourist business here. I had animal wax, tattoo demonstrations, souvenirs. But there was a little accident with one of the trained animals. One of our guests was hurt very badly. So I was shut down, put out of business, and since then, I've lived here all alone. And the only company I have is the same beast that mauled that unlucky tourist. The same beast that made me a hermit. A monster that, just by coincidence, is identical to one what attacked me when I was just a child and left me. Oh, he looks actually bang on. A deformed man. Jeez, now I'm all depressed. Thanks a lot. <laughs> Can't you just leave me alone now? Um, no, I'm in here, so we're partying. I'm Bob and Threadbear. I'm Bob and Threadbear. Are you my mother? No, your mother was a duck. Now beat it. I'm a pirate cannonball head. Who are you? My name's Meat Hook, and I think you've got a little attitude problem. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to call you cannonball head. That's okay. I'd rather have a cannonball head than a ponytail. Okay, <laughs> simmer down. I meant to call you Chrome Dome. 
by you. Oh, <laughs> You're telling me that was the wrong thing to choose? I'm going back in. I suppose you've come to invade my peaceful home and insult me again, eh? What was your name again, Cannonball Head? Look, I Make told friends, you yeah. not to call me that. My name's Meat Hook, and you still have a little attitude problem. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to call you Cannonball Head. That's okay. I'd rather have a cannonball head than a ponytail. Ha! Can you? Ha! Oh. <laughs> I was wondering if you could skip the stuff <laughs> that he's that they've said already. <laughs> hey, you've got a pretty good sense of humor. Ha! Was <laughs> humor. Something really funny. Ha! He's gonna show me his wiener. Frick! Please show me, Mr. Meat. Yes, please show me, Mr. Meat. Ha! <laughs> ha! Watch this. Oh boy. Say hello, Roger. That's what you call it? Hello, Roger. Ha ha ha. Pretty good, eh? Got, got a does whole it? Routine, but I don't have okay. the time to do it all right now. Thank Maybe you. if we're ever on a long ocean voyage together. But until then, I'm a very busy man, so. Could you show me that neato tattoo thing again? Well, what does this have to okay, do with anything? But just one more time. Haha, <laughs> watch this. Say hello, Roger. Hello, Roger. What? What the? F what do I. Like, why? What do I. What do I need to know about this weird Roger tattoo? Could you show me that neato tattoo thing again? Well, okay, but just one more time. Haha, <laughs> watch this. Say hello, Roger. Hello, Roger. <laughs> Could you show me that neato tattoo thing again? Well, okay, but just one more time. Haha, <laughs> watch this. Say hello, Roger. Hello, Roger. Okay, I get it. Cool. Bye. Wrong house. Whoops, I just realized that this is the wrong house. Yep, see you later. Oh, okay. Have a nice time on Melee Island. Say goodbye, Roger. Goodbye, <laughs> Roger! Okay. Okay, we'll come back to him. I got other places to check out. I don't know why I'll come back to him, but clearly there's something there that I probably want. It's just like the one on the other side. Okay, let's go investigate the other spots. Use chicken on cable. This is exactly what a pulley would sound like. Wow, it works both ways. That's some chicken. <laughs> That's some chicken. <laughs> That's some chicken. Hey, Gex, what's up, man? How's it going? The name's Cannon. Cannonball. Okay, was that the shore or the island? It's both. All right. Let's go to the lights. It's a long trek, but we gotta hit our 10k steps, so whatever. Uh, chat, how many of you, by a show of words, uh, have never played this game before, never heard of it, first experience, and now you're loving it? Oh, okay, goblins. None shall pass. <laughs> Okay. None shall pass. Stop! You must pay a toll. Okay, a few of you. Heard not played, loving it right now. Nice. Heard it's a classic, never played it. Hadn't played it till I watched Luckless play it and love it. 
<laughs> Nuns shall pass. Okay, it's not a goblin, it's a troll. How much is the toll? How much is the toll? Well, what have you got? I have... Oh, I have a lot of things. I have a lot of things. Let's start low. I can't give him my pulley. I can give him meat that seemingly never... I, I just keep getting more. Some semi-rancid meat? I want something that'll attract attention, but have no real importance. Attracts attention, but no real importance. <laughs> Construction paper jockey Construction shorts. paper jockey shorts? <laughs> Don't be silly. Oh, not like that. You have three chances to give me what I want. Then I eat ya. None shall pass. You can't pass until you pay the toll. Well, that seems rough. I have three chances to give him what he wants. You know, I don't even have to try that hard to make a lot of things How sexual in this game. Was? I want something that'll attract attention, but have no real importance. What? None shall pass. Oh. None shall pass. That's pretty useless. Yeah. But it's not what I want. Aww. Bro, I thought I thought that was gonna be it. It would attract attention because it got other people to come and dig there, and None everyone digs there. It's like a pass. thing, and then you get the T-shirt, right? But it's not gonna draw too much attention. Damn it! I thought None I, thought, I was like, that's pass. gonna be it for sure. I could give None him the the meeting minutes. I don't, I don't know. That's pretty useless, but it's not what I want. I got a lot of useless shit None here. Shall pass. Ah, a red herring. <laughs> Pass. Oh, okay. Oh. I thought... I thought that the red herring... I thought the red herring would be... Something I would just keep in my inventory the entire game as like a... Like a troll to the players, actually. That's funny. <laughs> That's cool. Okay. <laughs> nice. Stands previously owned vessels. POVs. Sick. Okay, baby. We got boats. Spiffy. Underutilized word, definitely. Oh, grog. Use with... I don't have anything to put it in. Okay, I need something for that, obviously. Welcome to Stan's previously owned vessels. I'm off searching the globe right now for the finest in previously owned marine transportation. Well, Have a look around. I'll helpful. be right back. Stan. <laughs> Stan. Okay. Um. I better not. Let's just see if I can push any boats. I can't move it. Nope. What about this one? I can't move it. Okay. Good. This is going well. Oh, hello. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. We got tons of other things. Where am I? Oh! All right. All right. Go to this big boat. I'm surprised this one is still afloat. Now, do I need to buy a boat for any reason? Like, is that what this is about? Looks like one of those well-engineered imports. But even if so, like, I'm not... He's not even here to buy it from. This one's got better fuel economy. This ah, one's as a is. Ah, upper Yeah, that's probably more my style, let's be honest. Fuel economy. Cheaper to operate. Dull, dull, dull. Oh, God. I don't know. 
don't think I have anything for this that I can think of. Any, any verbiages that I could try on this grog machine? There must be a more honest way to get some spare change. I thought he was going to do something cool there. That got me very excited. Huh. Nothing. Huh. Nothing. Video game? Three? Okay, that's not working. That doesn't seem to work. Oh, hold on. Uh, 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 hold on. I got, I got coins. Huh. Nothing. You're kidding me. That, did that actually take, that actually took one. I'm not down to stupid enough to do that twice. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, I like that he even calls me on it. I'm not stupid enough to do that twice. Yeah, me neither. Uh, totally. No. Why would I? Why would I do that? Huh. Nothing. Okay. Well. Uh. Okay. I got one last hope here. I got a house. And if I don't get any direction from the house, I don't know what's going to happen. <gasps> oh, God. Yes. Now Captain we're talking. Smirk's big body pirate gym. Oh. Prices. Yes. Sword training. 30 pieces of weight. Cannon firing. 160 pieces of weight. Balls extra. Grappling hook. 130 pieces of weight. Hook extra. Guys. We've done it. I'm going to check the path first because otherwise I'll probably forget. Excellent. This is great news. Please be awake. I think I'll knock. It'd only be polite. Do it. What do you want, you wimpy <laughs> little spineless maggot? Hi, Dad. Um... <laughs> Could you train me to be better than the Swordmaster? Better than the Swordmaster? Oh, nice. <laughs> you could never be half the sword fighter Carly is. Even with hours of hard work and sweat and blood. Look at his close-up face? Yeah, no, it's good. I remember fighting side... Well, the local constabulary had us cornered. It looked like we were done for, but then she said... But I digress. You just don't have what it takes. I do so have what it takes. It's you a villain do from Avatar? It's Wizzy. That's funny. I do so. I gotta stand up to him. You do not. I do so. Oh, I like your spirit. <laughs> I'll do what I can. Sick. Of course, it'll cost you. Yeah, man. What do you got? I figured you'd do it for free. I can't give him the chicken. I don't think. Well, I've got 30 pieces I'll just of pay it. him. Say no more, say no more. Let's see your sword. Okay, check it out. Guys, we are yeah, freaking flying now. This is a nice one. Let's get to it. Okay, you maggot. Why don't you whip that sword out and let's see what you can do with it? Say no more. Boy, you fight like a dairy farmer. <laughs> I usually don't waste my time with vermin like yourself. But seeing as this LeChuck thing has put a cramp on business, I got no choice. You fight I need like the a money. dairy farmer. Yes, I can see this is going to take some special measures. Just want you to know... I don't do this with everyone. 
It's only because I feel that special student mentor pieces of eight bonding Is this that like I'm a going to these lengths. Sex dungeon? I'm gonna put you up against the machine. The machine? Is this gonna hurt? Yikes. Hey, a monkey, actually. Come at me. Don't be afraid, you won't hurt me. Distance, distance! Distance, distance! No! Beat first, then lunge! Distance, distance! No! Beat first, then lunge! Hours later. <laughs> You're starting to get the hang of it. More hours later. I love that, the narrator. Not bad. You've got good form. Now I'm gonna let you in on the true secret of sword fighting. Sword fighting is kind of like making love. It's not always what you do, but what you say. Any fool pirate Ooh, can swing what you a say. shot piece of metal around and hope to cut something. But the pros, they know just when to cut their opponent with an insult. One that catches them off guard. You see, kid, your wit's got to be twice as sharp as your sword. Let's try a couple of insults out, <sighs> shall yeah, we? now we're talking. Okay. Imagine this. We're fighting up a storm. Just like Carla and I were doing at Port Royal. There's a sudden break in the fighting, and I say to you, you fight like a dairy farmer. <laughs> you respond with? Uh. So's your mother. Yeah. Take that. I can see we've got a lot of work to do here. <laughs> Should have went rubber glue. Should have went rubber glue. responded with something like, How appropriate. You fight like a cow. You see, it's razor sharp That's good. wit like that That's fair. that wins fights. Let's try another. Imagine this. You're trapped up against a wall. Mm -hmm. My sword just slashed two cuts into your face. Mm -hmm. I say... Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. Yeah. You respond with? I respond with. So is your so mother. So is your mother. I can see we're <laughs> in deep trouble here. I mean. Oh, a correct response to soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab would have been something like. First, you better stop waving it around like a feather duster. See? Razor sharp. Mine was better. Now, I suggest you go out there Mine was and better. learn some insults. I can't help but feel like I've been ripped off. No, <laughs> no shit. I'm sure you're feeling something similar. <laughs> There's no answer. What? Bro. That's not cool. Uh, how, where am I going to learn insults? The used ship emporium is useless. I can go to the bridge. I could maybe talk to some pirates. Troll's gone. Okay, okay. Uh, for insults, first thing comes to mind, I'm thinking bar. Oh, okay, we got bloodthirsty. I, can I interact with them at all? No, get out of here. No, I can't. Circus? Sword? Uh, let me just see what happens at the Swordmaster, okay? I'm going to see what happens. I'll be like, yeah, he basically trained me. Basically. I just need to toss insults, apparently. So, how hard could it be? How dare you approach the sword master? Oh, it's you again. Okay. Listen here. I beg your pardon. I must talk to you. I doubt that. Everyone who comes here is prepared to fight. Yeah. Let's be honest. You're here to prove yourself to the pirate leaders mm -hmm. in hopes of one day being as immoral as they are. Mm-hmm. Yep. Nailed it right on the head. 
Jeez. This is not going well. I can tell by the sarcastic expression on your face that you've been fully trained by Captain Smirk. I can also tell from the Melee Times sports page that you haven't won a single fight. This would be nothing more than a waste of my time. Yeah, she is correct on both of those. Who the hell am I going to fight? Oh! Uh... Maybe... Maybe I could fight uh, Chrome Dome with his little... Um, Hook hands. Let's fight. Let's go to Chrome Dome's place. What should be wanted, you scurvy lover? Or maybe this guy. My name is Guybrush Streetwood. <laughs> Prepare to die. Come on. Oh, hell yeah. Okay. 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 You fight like a dairy farmer. You fight like a dairy farmer. How appropriate. You fight like a cow. Ooh, he's good. He's slinging slurs like none other. Okay, well played. Well played. Have you stopped wearing diapers yet? Uh, okay. God damn it. I don't have a good response to this yet. Fine. I am rubber, you are glue. <laughs> pull out the pull out the ultimate. Did that You're work? You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. Son of a bitch. <laughs> I mean, I mean Okay, let's go with the feather duster route. First you'd better stop waving it like a feather duster. I give up. You win. So, am I to assume? Move out of the way, <laughs> or I cut me way through. Okay. I imagine I'm gonna learn like different My insults from these Guybrush dudes, and then eventually die. I'll have all the ones equipped to to fight back with, right? Yeah. See, now I got diapers. Here we go. Let's uh let's go dairy farmer. You fight Classic like a opener. dairy farmer. Oh, I'm shaking, I'm shaking. Oh, that's not a good reply. I think we might win. Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. First, you better stop waving it like a feather duster. Good one. Good one. Yeah. Classic you retort. Make me want to puke. Don't have a good one for this. That really sucks. Uh, great. You fight like a cow, How I guess. Appropriate. You fight like a cow. You have the manners of a beggar. Definitely new. Uh, well, First, sure. You'd better stop waving it like a feather duster. Just kill me, why don't you? Yikes! Nice move. Don't worry, guys. This is all for practice. I'm just going to wait here. I'm just going to wait at the forks of death and uh, kill whoever Stop comes by. It's going well so far. <laughs> to your health. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. We got this. Uh. Oh, interesting. What if we go into the brains? Or what if we even go, boy, you're ugly? Or what an idiot. These are all good. Let's see if he knows the retort Soon to shish kebab. Soon you my sword like a shish kebab. It's advanced. First, you better stop waving it like a feather duster. Mm-hmm. Well played. Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. Bro, I literally just used that. First, you'd better stop waving it like a feather duster. Advantage us. Ting, 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 ting. Oh, you make me want to puke. You make me think somebody already <laughs> did. Okay, okay, so that's the... <laughs> okay, that's good. I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. I don't think we have this one yet. God damn it. How appropriate. 
you fight like a cow. All right. I give up. You win. Just, just keep going. Right, this better be important. I just got to get all my insults in. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. I am rubber. You are glue. I see a lot of deleted messages. Is that is that people spoiling? Okay, I don't have a retort to rubber glue. Have you stopped wearing diapers yet? Oh, I am rubber. You are glue. <laughs> I think we're going to beat him. Because he's dumb. Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. First, he'd better stop waving it like a feather duster. Okay, he knows that one. Well played. Have you stopped wearing diapers yet? I don't think I have this one. I am rubber, you are glue. <laughs> People fall at my feet when they see me coming. That's new. You make me think somebody already did. <laughs> uncle, uncle! The sword fighting is insult response. Winner gets used an insult. Yeah, I, I get that, but aren't Watch I also aren't I also learning the insults lover. from them? My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. I thought the point was that I was learning what the what the replies were. You fight like a dairy farmer. How appropriate. You fight like a cow. Okay, he knows that one. I got this scar on my face during a mighty struggle. See, like, if, if, if I don't know the, the retort there, what can I even do? First, you'd better stop waving it like a feather duster. You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. Huh. How appropriate. You fight like a cow. I give up. You win. Okay, maybe I'm not maybe I'm missing the point here. Whatever you want, you scurvy lover. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. I'd be in real trouble if you ever used them. You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. Yeah, and then I say, I'd be in real trouble if you ever used them. I'd be in real trouble if you ever used them. Yeah, yeah. Now I go... And we'll say... You have the manners of a beggar. I wanted to make sure you'd feel comfortable with me. Okay. Now I, I know that. I heard you were a contemptible snake. See, like, I, I don't have anything for that. Um, okay. I am rubber, you are glue. I give up. You win. Hmm. I'm learning them. I'm learning new lines from these guys. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. See, like, we just learned this one. 
I've heard you were a contemptible sneak. So now I could now I could learn what the no one's ever heard of you at all. Yeah, see now I can learn the retort. My handkerchief will wipe up your Holy blood. shit, there's so many. Handkerchief will wipe up your blood? I am rubber, you are glue. <clears throat> it just takes time. Keep going. I yeah, okay. I heard you were a contemptible sneak. Yeah, well, no one ever heard of you. Too bad no one's ever heard of you at all. Classic. I got this scar on my face during a mighty struggle. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Good. Manners of a beggar? You have the manners of a beggar. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We're doing it, guys. I give up. You win. We're doing it. We're victorious. Now do I fight? Do I keep fighting? What you be wanting, you scurvy lubber? How do we know when we've got them all? I guess, I guess the test is to see if she'll fight My us. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. That was our first win. Okay, you make me want to puke. <sighs> you make me want to puke. You make me think somebody already did. God damn, he's a wise one. Okay, baby, let's go. Come on, come on. You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. I know this one. I know this one. I'd be in real trouble if you ever used them. I'd be in real trouble if you ever used them. Nailed it. <laughs> this is actually really cool how you've done this. Uh, people fall at my feet when they see me coming. People fall at my feet when they see me coming. Oh, I'm shaking, I'm shaking. Nice. I don't know if, if I know what the answer to that one is. Uh, I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. They must have taught you everything you know. Okay, now I know. Yeah, good. All the responses are very logical. This is the end for you. You got a crawling cur. I haven't heard that. Okay. I wanted to make sure you'd so feel I think we have to lose me. this one. Yikes, nice move. Yikes. Come on. Stopping a pirate can be dangerous to your health. <laughs> uh My name is Guybrush Streetwood. Prepare to die. Ace aid. Oh, thanks, man. Thanks for the super chat. Looking forward to the next game. Yeah, me too. I don't know uh I don't know how far into this we are. Okay, so I want to learn this one. This is the end for you, you gutter crawling cur. And I've got a little tip for you. Get the point. Cur tip point? Is that like a thing? I guess so. I've heard you were a contemptible snake. I've never heard of you at all. Something like that. Yep. Too bad no one's ever heard of you at all. Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. Classic right hook. Oh, yeah. My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. Oh, I'm shaken. Oh, I'm shaken. I think I might be ready, you guys. I give up. You win. <laughs> Hey, this better be important. I, do I just keep, like, will they just send guys at me endlessly? My name is Guybrush Streetwood. Prepare to die. What's the handkerchief one? My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. So, you got that job as oh. janitor. After okay, all. so that's a new one that we unlocked. There we go. There we go. There we go. This is the end for you, you gutter crawling cur. Yeah, tip point that whole thing. Yep. And I've got a little tip for you. Get the point. Okay, we're cruising. Uh 
We know that one. We know this one. I don't know if we know this one. People fall at my feet when they see me coming. Even before they smell your breath. Ooh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Locked and loaded. There are no words for how disgusting you are. <laughs> Jesus. I mean... I'm speechless. Lubricant is essential. <laughs> of course. Of course it is. Oh, disgusting. Was that janitor? Wasn't that something to do with the puking? So you got that job as a janitor after you all. You fight like a cow. Yeah, thanks. Thanks, Thomas. Am, Am I saying that win? right? Yeah, I need to learn that retort. Hey, this better be important. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Okay. No words for how disgusting you are. There are no words for how disgusting you are. Yes, there are. You just never learned them. That's okay. There it is. People fall at my feet when they see me coming. Before they smell ya. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Even before they smell your breath? Yeah. And then there's another one. Uh... This one, I think? I don't think we have a retort. My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. Hey, Ludwig, what's so, up, man? You got that job as a janitor after all. Okay, handkerchief is janitor. I got this scar on my face during a mighty struggle. I don't think I know this one. The scar on your face. Uh, could you repeat that? <laughs> I didn't quite get it. Does he say it? I said, oh, he does. I That's got this sick. scar on my face during a mighty struggle. Yeah, I don't think I know it. I am rubber, you are glue. Scar on nice, face, I need to know. Nice move. <laughs> David, thanks for gifting a sub to Lucky Mark. That's so cool, man. Thanks. Thank you for doing that, man. You've gifted a couple subs. That's so nice. Hey, where are the rest of them? Oh, here we go. I appreciate that, David. Thanks, man. Move out of the way, or I cut my way through. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Okay. Where's the scar? I got this scar on my face during a mighty struggle. Oh, I am rubber, you are glue. He doesn't know it. Diapers? Have you stopped wearing diapers yet? Oh, I am rubber, you are glue. Now, when he. It, is the fact that he's not teaching us a new retort, does that mean that we've already learned it then? Or do we have to do it multiple times? People fall at my feet when they see me coming. <laughs> Look at this noob, yeah. Even before they smell your breath. Oh, good one. Okay, let's see what he has for me. My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. Yeah, I know this one. I know this one. So you got the job as a janitor. That's rough, man. That's that's a that's a rough one. So you got that job as a janitor after all. Wow, you're good enough to fight the sword master. Is that right? Hey, this better be important. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. 
Okay, let's. Where's the scar one? I got this scar on my face during a mighty struggle. Oh, I am rubber. You are glue. Maybe, maybe I already know this one. Have you stopped wearing diapers yet? Why did you want <laughs> to borrow one? Okay. That's that's new. <laughs> okay, that's good. You make me want to puke. You make me think somebody already did. <laughs> what if I just go into one of these? What an idiot. What an amateur insult. Maybe. I've heard you were a contemptible sneak. Somebody's never heard of you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Too bad no one's ever heard of you at all. Got a real duel here. Wow, you're good enough to fight the Swordmaster. Yeah, I think we probably are, but I need to learn the Scar one. Aye, this better be important. Because you know I'm going to go to the Swordmaster, and that's the first one she's going to whip out. Die. And uh, that'll be bad. I got this scar on my face during a mighty struggle. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Have you stopped wearing diapers yet? Why? Did you want to borrow one? Good one. Have you stopped wearing diapers yet? Why, did you want to borrow one? You fight like a dairy farmer. How appropriate. You fight like a cow. I've spoken with apes more polite than you. What did he say? Apes? Uh, could you repeat that? I didn't quite get it. I said, I've spoken with apes more polite Is that, than that you. Might, that might be new. It could be this one, feel comfortable. I can't remember if we've seen this one. I wanted to make sure you'd feel comfortable <laughs> no, with me. Not good. Not good. I give up. You win. Okay, so we learned. I think we learned a new one. I don't know if we've seen apes. Stopping a pirate can be dangerous to your health. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. I've spoken with apes more polite than you. I'm glad to hear you attended your family reunion. <laughs> You're no match for uh, my brains, you poor fool. That would assume you have one or something like that. Uh... Something like this? You ever use them? Your brains? I'd be in real trouble if you ever used them. Ting, 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 ting. Um. Scar, please? I need the scar. Wait, where is it? I got this scar on my face during a mighty struggle. Come on. I hope now you've learned to stop picking your <laughs> nose. There it is. People fall at my feet when they see me coming. That's got to be the last one. Before they smell you? Even before they smell your breath? Uh, 
My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. Rubber glue. So you got that job as janitor after all? What? Where did my sword go? I'm going to fight the sword master. I'm going. I feel confident. Just like Rafe does. Thank you, Rafe. Appreciate that. Thank you very much. Thanks to all the new members today, you guys. That's so kind. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's do this. I'm ready. I don't care if she says no. How dare you approach the sword master with... Oh, it's you again. I beg your pardon. Oh, I should have said I'm here to kill to you. I doubt that. Everyone who comes here is prepared to fight. Let's be honest. You're here to prove yourself to the pirate leaders in hopes of one day yeah, being Dot as immoral as they are. Yep. And space goes right to that. Head. So, Gee, I don't know. smart. I can tell by the sarcastic expression on your face that you've been fully trained by Captain Smirk. Hope I took Let's notes. This I don't with. think I need him. Only once All have here. I met such a coward. Hit me with a zinger right off the bat, eh? I don't know if we've heard that. Only once have I met a coward. God damn it. <laughs> uh, say uh, it again? Could you repeat that? I didn't quite get it. Only once have I met such a coward. Only once. Okay. Uh-huh. 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 Must have taught you everything you know. He must have taught you everything you know. Ting, 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 ting. We got it. Now I know what filth and stupidity really are. Whoa, that's new. Filth and stupidity? Damn. Okay. I wanted to make sure you'd feel comfortable <laughs> with me. Not good. There are no clever moves that can help you now. There's so many more zingers, you guys. What? I haven't heard of this. No clever moves that can help you now. Damn it. She's bested me. Oh, yeah, here. Yes, there are. You we have. Never learned them. We have. I'm so quick to give up. No one will ever catch me fighting as badly as you do. Got it. No one will catch me fighting as badly as you do. You make me think somebody already did? Could that be the one? Uh, could you repeat that? I didn't quite get it. No one will ever catch me fighting as badly as you do. No one will catch me fighting as badly as you do. Wanted to make sure you'd feel comfortable with me. You make me think somebody Shit. already did? I don't know. That might be new, too. I don't know. I usually see people like you pass oh, out on tavern. That's a hundred percent new. That's a hundred percent new. Tavern floors. I don't have that. Don't have that. Mm mm. Mm mm. Mm mm. I wanted to make sure you'd feel comfortable with me. Damn it. Is that it? Oh, we're not done yet. If your brother's like you. Better to marry a pig. Holy! She's ripping us right now. I've never heard of any of these. I am rubber, you are glue. 
We're not dead I yet. I hope you have a boat ready for a quick escape. Oh my god, I still have so many more to learn. This is just insane. <sighs> Jesus. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Okay. Who's behind you, a three-headed monkey. Back to the streets. I hope this teaches you a lesson. Now scram. <laughs> okay, the Zing Lord. Impressed, not gonna lie. Let's go back out to the rubble rousers. Get over here. Let's try and learn some more zingers. <laughs> You can't learn her insults? Move out of the way, or I cut my way through. My god, dude, you make it look really hard. You have answers. She'll give you different insults from all the pirates. I don't know. I'm just trying my best. My name is Guybrush Three I'm just trying Prepare my best to here. Die. Okay. Only once have I met such a coward. That's not fair. You're using the Swordmaster's insults, I see. Lubricant is essential. Swordmaster's insults. So what's interesting is he didn't he didn't give us a retort though. So this would be a Swordmaster's insult as well. If your brother's like you, better to marry a pig. That's not fair. You're using the Swordmaster's insults, I see. Huh. <laughs> Apes more polite than you is the family reunion. Um... Boat. I hope you have a boat ready for a quick escape. But I guess we're not going to learn these. That's not fair. We're not going to learn You're these back. The sword master's insults, I see. So. Wow, you're good enough to fight the sword master. All right, let's just try fighting her again. See what happens. Morton, thanks for the super chat. Says you have the answers. She just has different questions with the same responses. Okay, so we're just trying to like. We're just trying to match. We're just trying to find something that would then work. Fair enough. I'm back, and boy, are you in trouble this time. Let's get this over with. We'll just try and find something I that fits. Will milk every drop of blood from your body. Okay, milk. Dairy farmer. Something about a cow. Right? How appropriate. You fight like a cow. Zing. If your brother's like you, better to marry a pig. Yeah, okay. What's the thing about a pig? Tip point. Brother. Pig. Oh, uh, family reunion maybe? I'm glad to hear you nope. attended your family reunion. Nope. That will not do. Incorrect. No one will ever catch me fighting as badly as you do. You make me think they already did. You make me think somebody already what? did? I thought that was the one. My wisest enemies run away at the first sight of me. These are fucking... Riddles. Wisest enemies run away at the first sight of me. Even before they smell your breath? Even before they smell your breath? <gasps> Let's go! 
Now I know what filth and stupidity really are. Uh, family reunion? I'm glad to hear you attended your family reunion. We're doing it, guys. I usually see people like you passed out on tavern floors. Oh, uh, could that be the janitor thing then? Could that be the janitor thing? So you got that job as a janitor after all. Nope. It's so cool how his inflection changes, eh? Like I hope you have a boat ready for a quick escape. Borrow one? Why? Did you want to borrow one? So that, that's the diaper one. That's the diaper reply. My name is feared in every dirty corner of this island. Is that janitor worthy? My name is feared in every corner of this island. So you got that job as a janitor after all. Killer. I give up. You win. <sighs> well, I hope you're happy. You can go back and brag to all your friends about how you beat the sword master. You'll need proof. Holy Here. smokes. This should convince them. Okay. <laughs> Jeez, that was so that was pretty tough. I, I honestly would have... I would have probably done three more fights with guys. Trying to learn those new replies. I don't think I would have... Uh, I think I would have been stuck there for a while. Let's check what we got. Are you shitting me? It says, I beat the Swordmaster. No, I'm happy about it. I love, I love, I love t-shirts. I love t-shirts. It's fine. It's totally cool. No thanks. I can't stand salesmen. Are there any of these guys shook up. that are I willing really to talk know. to me? I don't think it's wise to wake a sleeping pirate. I don't want to bother them. Oh. 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 So now we need to poison the dogs. There, gold finder. I don't know how though. Tell me again about pilfering the idol. There's, there's, it's got to be something to do with the, the canister that's in there, but I literally have no idea. Case in the mansion outside the town. You'll have to get past the guards. Oh, did I click the wrong one? The I may have. The tricky part will be getting past the dogs outside. Yeah. Hey, they're particularly vicious. Yeah, piranhas. They might be able to drug him or something. Yep, agreed. I'm the deadliest scallywag what ever swung a sword. Well, defeated the sword master, did you? Hey, you're a strong fella. You may keep the stylish t-shirt. We have enough. Okay. I'll just be running along now. Okay. Leave us to our drug. Come back later and tell us how you're doing. I'm gonna chill here. Actually, I'll try to open this. He'll say no. Hey, then he's gonna go to the left. I'm gonna here. go in. And I'm gonna fiddle with all the stuff until I can figure out how to make this happen. Okay. It's boiling hot. So we've got the meat. How can I how can I get how can I get this barrel? It doesn't seem to open. Like I was thinking maybe I need like uh you know something to put under there. But it doesn't seem to be vibing. That doesn't seem to work. I'm gonna I'm gonna try. 
I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try a hint and see what I'm missing. I'm gonna try. Should feed this meat to the poodles. Okay. No shit. I'm gonna try another one. Should feed this meat to the poodles at the governor's mansion. Uh huh. I solved it? Look at the items themselves? It's some sort of meat or meat like substance. Okay. Breathmaster, for the pirate who cares about first impressions. Uh huh. I think it's full of that foul stuff pirates drink. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah, so I already... I, I put the meat into this. But then I fed it to the dogs. And the dogs just ate it. Odd, read what it says. Oh. It's some sort of meat or meat-like substance. I didn't catch that, man. Look at meat with condiment. Okay. When I tried to combine... So you guys are saying... You guys are... I already combined those flowers thinking maybe they're poisonous. But for some reason I didn't think it actually worked. <laughs> I don't see anything special about it. I didn't think it actually worked. I had already done it? Oh my god. That is something that I would do, yeah. Yeah, that, no, that's... That fits the bill. That fits the bill. Mm -hmm. I literally didn't notice that it combined. I, I thought... I, I'm gonna have to watch that back. I'm going to have to go watch that back to see what happened. Because I feel like I tried it and then... You guys must have been like, what's he talking about? It clearly combined. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what the fuck. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. Okay? I don't know what to tell you. I, I, you know what? I'm sure you guys have never, ever made a mistake before. So, like, I can understand why you would, why you would think that. Okay. What am I what am I doing? Give meat dogs. Meat with condiment. And I saw that it had I saw the condiment thing. I'd read it multiple times. But I thought that that was from putting it in the thing because I didn't realize that I combined. Important notice. These dogs are not dead. They are only sleeping. No animals were harmed during the production of this game. Let's there sleeping peacefully. That is really good. Let's see if there's anything behind the house. No. That's good. Okay, so now, what else? What are we going to do in here? What are we going to do in here? Okay. A priceless Ming. Yes. We'll take that. Okay. This looks like a job for Fester's shine top. Uh oh. Eh, better leave this here. Okay. Hypnotized quarrelsome rhinoceros. No, not the red push, button. Push, push red button. Walk to. I I don't think I can click on any of these. Look at tremendous yak. It's a big, ugly, hairy yak wearing some wax lips. Push, push tremendous dangerous looking yak. I can't move it. Pull, pull tremendous dangerous looking yak. I can't move it. Walk to. 
pick up, staple remover. What the actual shit is happening? I'll need this. I don't even know what's that happening. Must be nuts. <laughs> I'm not. Okay, I don't even need to play. It's fine. Fuck! Gophers! Beautiful. I can't open it. Uh oh. <laughs> that should hold him for a while. <laughs> if only I had a file, I could get the idol. A file? Only you had a file. No time for reading now. Okay. I don't see anything special about it. It's gaping. Hmm, this door appears to be locked. So I could take this now. Uh, but I'm curious what will happen if I open this. Or will it be locked as well? I locked the sheriff in there. Okay. <laughs> okay all right. There doesn't seem to be anything else that I can do other than take the thing. So we'll take it now. Oh, shit. Oh, we have a ton of new toys. Oh, okay. So we picked up... I bet this will come in handy. We picked up a staple remover. I think it's some kind of religious text. For the church? They're yak-sized and covered with slobber. I'm certainly not going to chew on them. I'm certainly not going to chew on them. Gopher repellent. It says gophers won't come near you with this stuff on. A priceless Ming. And uh, is that the thing I needed to steal? I guess so. Okay. Okay, I got a couple of leads. Couple of leads. The dogs are sleeping. Let's go see what happens. Couple of leads. Uh, I'm going to go to the church and see if I can use that book. It says it's like a religious text about style. Which obviously, you know, it's pretty standard. Maybe. <laughs> this just seems like this is not going to work. Come on. There's nothing in here? Okay. A priceless Ming. Okay, there's nothing to interact with in this church. What if we, uh... Can we go back to the prison and try to find... Oh, wait. We also have... Hold on. We also have... What are the outstanding things? Okay, this is what I need to work on right now. We have the prisoner and the rat. And we have the safe in that guy's shop. And we have the uh, voodoo, voodoo lady. I'm going to go see that place real quick. Although I, I don't have a really a really good reason. 
to think it'll be any different. I'll just be running along now. <clears throat> Is this the new Siberia? Pretty close. Hey, I'm back and I'm ready to know more about the future. Uh, I'm assuming she's not coming back. Guess no one's here. Until we complete this trial. Let me uh, let me go talk to our pirate bros and see if that that vase is the thing that they wanted. Because we did steal the stuff. But I don't recall if they said what it was exactly that I was looking for. I just have steal from Mayor Drug Dogs. <laughs> Excellent notes. Come on. Welcome, young friend. Have you stolen the idol yet? It's an idol. Yeah, see, I don't have it yet. Tell me again about pilfering the idol. The governor keeps the idol in many hands in a display case in the mansion. In a display case. Okay, so clearly, yeah. You'll have to get past there the we guard, go. Naturally. The tricky part will be getting past the dogs outside. Hi, they're a particularly vicious breed. They might be able to drug him or something. Yeah. I'll just be running along now. Leave us to our drug. Come back later and tell us how you're doing. So we have the prisoner, the rat, the church, the safe, the guy across on the other island with the pulley, uh, the boat, but the guy is gone. And I, I don't really have a clear idea of where I should go with any of these guys. You know? Forgetting something what three pirates told you at the beginning? I mean, yeah, I guess so. I guess I am forgetting that. Let's take a hint. Oh! Otis, I can scare off the rats with the gopher repellent, maybe? I mean, it's not rat repellent. But... He's the he's the closest lead that I have, so we'll talk to him. See what happens. Okay, my dude. Oh, would he have a file? Oh, okay. Yeah, because he's he's a he's a he's a criminal mastermind. Would you happen to have a file? Of course he would. You think I'd be in here if I did? Of course he would. All I have is this carrot cake my Aunt Tilly made me. Well, that's helpful. You can have that if you bring me something to get rid of these rats. Okay, well, take the gopher I can't repellent. Stand carrot cake. I hope this works. Give. Hey, this might work on the rats. Thanks. I need Here's the cake. Great. So now I have cake. It's heavy. It's heavy. It's heavy. It's heavy. It's heavy. It's heavy. Okay. 
Okay. Church is done. Prisoner, I got the cake. Um, I need to find a file. I need to find a file. Is there anything happening back here in this alley? This is just where I met the guy. The, uh, sheriff. I don't think I have a way to open that, that safe yet. Hey, where'd you go? I hike halfway across the island to try and get you a reservation with the Swordmaster, who, by the way, says you can go jump in the lake. And when I come back, whew, you're gone. See if I ever do you a favor again, ungrateful little shoplifter. What the fuck? Why do I have this? It got rid of the cake. The cake and something else. Hurry up! What did I have before? Have <laughs> what, what is going on? Why is my inventory doing magical shit? Guys, I'm losing it. I'm losing it. It was in the cake? Okay, I guess I'm... I, I, there, is there not something that's happening? Is there not something that's happening when I am investigating stuff? <laughs> like, what the shit? If I look at it in my inventory, like, is it, is it just changing in front of my eyes? But I'm not, I guess I'm not seeing it. It's a raspy metal file. I, I don't know. I'm flabbergasted. But I need it to get the idol. Oh yeah, right. One, one second, bro. I'll be back. I'm flabbergasted. Did I try to open the cake? I don't, I don't know. Did I? Did I try to open the cake? I thought I just looked at the cake. What do I know? Apparently... I'm not even connected to this mouse and keyboard. It's all just happening. And I'm not even here. I'm just watching like you guys. I have no clue. <laughs> no clue. Okay. I've got the, I've got the file. I don't see anything special about it. Right. To the door. I need a file. We have a file now. I locked the sheriff in there. I locked the sheriff in there. Other door? <sighs> if you used or opened the cake, you would have gotten the file. I must have. I must have. <laughs> the, I guess, yeah, I mean, what am I going to say? Hmm, this door appears to be locked. What? Hmm, this door appears to be locked. That doesn't seem to work. No time for reading now. No shit. You're gonna see that you're gonna see this small descent into madness. I'm trying to go into the hole. Do I have to use the hole? <laughs> tell me tell me the solution is not use gaping hole. If it's use gaping hole, I swear to God. That doesn't seem to work. Okay, thank you. Good. Open gaping hole. It doesn't seem to open. No. Nope. Close gaping hole. That doesn't seem to work. Excellent. Pull gaping hole. I can't move it. Push the door. I can't move it. Okay. Open with the file. It doesn't seem to open. Are you kidding me? No, I don't want to open file. I want to open the door with the file. Use. F 
file, which I've done, on door. Hmm, this door appears to be locked. Is this a thing? Talk to the hole? Because the guy's inside? <laughs> I don't see anything special about it. I'm at the big hole in the wall. I've got the file. Are you fucking kidding me? Use file on rhinoceros toenails. Nice. Use file on lock. Nice. Pick up fabulous idol. Walk to gaping hole. Oh, are you gonna come out the door? <laughs> oh. That was a close one. Well, that was easy. At least I got the idol. That was easy. But I'm not done with you yet. Oh, maybe uh -oh. not. Thought you could get out of here with the idol of many hands, did you? Look, I can explain. So can I. You poisoned the governor's pet poodles. They're just sleeping. I Broke inadvertently. The, the door was unlocked. And stole one of her most valuable pieces of art. No, you've got it all wrong. Oh, really? Well, let's hear your explanation. Well, um... It belongs in a museum, It belongs obviously. in a museum. Ah! What's going on here? Oh, she's home? I caught this hoodlum making off with your <laughs> idol, Governor. He says it belongs in a museum. That's right, it does. What? You heard me, Festa. The real question is, how did he get in here while you yeah, we were on guard? Exactly. Uh, yeah. Oh, just go away, Festa. I can handle this. Hmm. I'll deal with you later. Sexual undertones. Sorry about him. He's new. I'm Governor Marley. Governor Elaine Marley. Hmm. Oh, that is quite different. You may. Uh, gosh. Gosh. <laughs> Relax, Mr. Threepwood. I know why you're here. Believe me, you're not the first who's tried. Although I have to admit, not many get as far as you have. Golly. Golly. My lookout told me of your arrival. The blind dude? I wanted dude? to meet you ever since I heard your fascinating name. Tell me. Guybrush, why do you want to be a pirate? You don't look like one. Your face is too... <laughs> don't sweet. see it. Mm, she wants it. Sexual undertones. <laughs> Girl. I see. Well, you're obviously not in the mood for idle chit-chat, are you? It goes I full on goofy. you've got many more exciting things to do. I won't take up any more of your time, Mr. Threepwood. Yeah, that section was no. um, frustrating. To say the least. Uh. I really wish I knew how to talk to women. <laughs> okay, well, to the pirates. It was frustrating because. Um, Oh, okay. Where do you think you're going, Throom Wade? Huh, maybe it won't be so easy. <laughs> Buzz off, Fester. Buzz off, Fester. I think you need to cool off. Hand over your sword. Uh-oh. This is the end of the road, my little pantalooned pal. Uh-oh. Your troublemaking days on Melee Island are over. 
My plans for the governor are far too important and much too near completion to risk letting a would-be pirate like you get in the way. So long, Mr. Spice. The end? Or droop face or whatever Game over? Name is. No. I can hold my breath for 10 minutes. That's like my this one talent. Turn out to be a pretty good day. This is no problem for Guybrush Threepwood. Oh my god, there's so many toys down here. Oh my god. Can I pick this up? Pick up the idol. Oh yeah, hell. Oh, easy. Where am I going? I guess I'll be needing a sword. Uh huh. This one will do. Whoa, we sure showed him. <laughs> what the fuck is that? <laughs> what was that? I'm so confused. Hey, what are you doing just standing around? The governor's what? been kidnapped. What? By whom? LeChuck's got her on that ship that just sailed off. He caught her alone when she came down here to rescue you. Well, I'm afraid we've seen the last of her. <laughs> it's like... I just went from like, okay, mistakenly looking in the cake, didn't even know that that happened, to, no, to having to do all the verbs on the gaping hole, except for just walk to it. To... I don't know. What, like, what else would you do down there? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how it works, Sniff. That's just how it works. That's how the so brain works. So where were you this I, whole time? Sleeping? It just happens, you know? Hey, I'm a lookout, not a bodyguard. Where did they go? LeChuck's taken the governor back to his hideout on Monkey Island. I'm afraid okay. no pirate on this island is brave enough to follow him there. I am. But hey, good luck. Now we're going to go to that oh, boat yeah. place. I almost forgot. Uh, they left this note. You can have it, but I don't think you'll like what it says. Oh, Governor. Why did you have to risk your life for me? Yeah, because she wants Maybe you guy care brush more than I thought. Maybe you wood. Just as I now realize how much I care for you. It's my fault the Governor's in this mess, and I swear I'll get her out of it. Even if I have to sail to Monkey Island myself to get her. It's the first thing you should do. What was that attention symbol? Okay, all of our stuff's back. Is attention this going to change into something? Because I looked at it Your in my inventory. Is alive and well and by my side as she was always meant to be. If you try to find us, you will only meet with horrifying disaster. Yours truly, Captain LeChuck. Let's see. I better. I got double check. No, nope, still a note. Actually, it's more like a fabulous doorstop. Did that change? <sighs> okay, let's go. I'm a pirate now, baby. Oh. <laughs> Looks like a fine pewter tanker. <laughs> there we go. Now I can probably get some stuff out of the back. Oh, should I pick them all up? <laughs> yep. Looks like a fine pewter tanker. <laughs> He's not using these. <laughs> well, I'm gonna... I don't know. Use some meat again. Ow! Got it! Stewed meat. Okay. Now, use the mug on the barrel. Gotta be it. It's about this time. This stuff is eating right through the mug. Oh. Is it? Oh, I still have it, though. Looks like a fine pewter tankard. Should I fill all of these? I think I have enough already. Okay. 
<laughs> Should I grab some of this stuff? I don't want to put that in. No! Alright. I guess. Let's go talk to the crybaby. <laughs> What's wrong, old sot? I can't even turn in my quest. The governor is gone. <laughs> the Chuck and his spectral crew came and got her. Mm -hmm. They put her in the ghost ship and spirited her away. Oh, she was so good to me. Always conveniently losing those health board reports. <laughs> For a small consideration, of course. What'll become of my business? Oh, woe is me. <laughs> what can I do to save her? You must get a ship and go after her. Yeah, I already Ghost pieced that together. Ghost is on Monkey Island. Everybody knows that. Don't ask me how. All you need to do is find a way there. Well, I, yeah, I already know. Will you join me? Uh, alas, I cannot go <laughs> to see an hey. old war injury. <laughs> Stuff flying out of his I'm mouth. I'm sure you understand. Where can I get a ship? Why, it's Smiling Stan's used shipyard. Same as everybody else. Yep. Tell him I sent you. We're old friends. Get me a drink. Get your own drink. Already done. Right. I'm off. Good luck. Okay. Be sure to wear your mittens. There was something happening. And your galoshes. And don't forget to write. Bye now. Bye now. <laughs> yeah, see, my cup, like, evaporated. So, like... There, maybe there's, like, a timed thing at some point, but right now, I'm, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna waste another mug. Okay, we need to go to... Away. We need to go away from here. The inventory is going to strike again. Oh, did something else happen? Look, I, I, the cup melted away. That, I know. So, like, we're, we're good. Seems like you might have to something to do with that grog before it eats the mug. I know, but, like, what? We'll see. Until I feel I need to do it, I'm not going to do it. Nope. I'm just going to the used ship. That's what I'm told to do. That's what I'm going to do. We're going to get the ship. Howdy! <laughs> oh no. The cowboy I'm hat? I'm Stan of Stan's previously owned vessels. And I'd stand on my head to make you a deal. What sort of craft are you looking for? <laughs> That's outstanding. Big, <laughs> fast, slow. Fast. You want it? I got it. And if I don't got it, I'll get it. I want to make you a deal that you're happy with. Because if you're not happy, I'm not happy. But I know you're gonna leave here happy today. How do I know? Just look at all these ships. I've got something it's for like the price everyone. is right. Come, take a look around. Rod Roddy? Is that his name? Roddy Rod or something like that? So tell me, what are you interested in looking at today? I don't know. Uh, the best. Let me see the best ship you've got. Hey, it's nice to meet a man who appreciates quality. I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. Now this, this is a ship fit for a king. I mean, we're talking 15 staterooms, a fireplace in every one. I could probably afford that, right? Pools, one indoor, one outdoor. We're talking rotating ballroom. We're talking heated crow's nest. We're talking 200 feet of ocean going decadence. And all for one low price. Speaking of price, how much would you like to spend? <laughs> uh, money is no object. Money is no object. Well, it is with me. <laughs> how much you got? Fair enough. Uh, well, 
No more than 173 pieces of eight. I have 371 pieces of eight. Wait. I think we must Wait. be talking about completely different ships here. You've obviously been out of the ship market for quite some time. I doubt you're carrying enough cash on you for this transaction. You wouldn't happen to have any other means of finance, would you? Sexual undertones. Did I, uh, was the thing reversed or am I dyslexic now? Probably answered my own question. Credit? Actually, I was hoping to get one on credit. <laughs> Sorry, kid. Neither a borrower nor a lender be. Yeah, that was weird, right? That's just okay, old it wasn't Stan's just me, Peter. philosophy. If you've got a job, the storekeeper in town might extend you some credit. Then we'd have something to talk about. A job? Unless, of course, you've already got some other means of financing. What about the chicken? All I have is this rubber chicken. Is it one of those rubber chickens with a pulley in the middle? That's the one. I already got one of those. Damn it. You wouldn't happen to have any other means of finance, would you? Nope. On second thought, this may not be the ship for me. Okay, but I got five other guys coming back to look at this baby today. Don't count on it being here if you change your mind. Mm -hmm. So, what else can I show you? <laughs> okay, I'm just going to take a quick break. I'm actually going to keep going for a bit longer. Uh, I just, I'm going to go grab like a really quick bite. Give me like two mins. I'm going to grab something and I'll eat it while Stan talks our balls off. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I'm back. <laughs> you guys saying this game's 60 hours? I don't think so. I don't think so, Tim. New game's coming out on um, Monday. I'm eating a uh, Kirkland protein bar, chocolatey chunks cookie dough, 21 grams of protein. Not bad. They're not bad. They're serviceable. Hi from Korea. Hey. Your name is so German sounding. Um. How long to beat told me this game was like uh, six hours, six and a half hours. Is the second one longer or shorter? How long to beat Monkey Island 2? Yeah, about the same. 
Main plus extras, seven to eight hours. Lechuk's Revenge. Lots of sugars and protein bars. This one's got uh, five grams of sugar. That's fine. Hi from Ireland. Hey, how's it going? Did Mr. Meat Chrome Dome say something about a long sea voyage in his tattoo show? I don't recall, but maybe. But um, I think the plan is I'll probably finish this one tomorrow. Start the second one on Friday. Finish that Saturday, Sunday kind of thing. So, yeah. I'll definitely do more LEGO streams. Yep. 100%. So, yeah. We'll dive back in as soon as I finish this. If you guys don't mind. Have a good one, Celso. What's your dog's name, Celso? If you have the time, I really recommend Curse of Monkey Island. I've heard it's quite good, but um, I, honestly, I don't think I will have the time. <laughs> what if we do mind? <laughs> well, suck it up. Any plans for the third Monkey's Island in the future? Are you talking about the new the new release or the third one that's already out? There's kind of some confusion. There's technically four Monkey Island games. This one, Monkey Island 2, Curse, and something else. But the last two weren't made with the original guy. This is what I've learned in the past like two days. And on Monday, they're releasing a brand new one. Not a remaster or anything like that, brand new that is made by the same guy that made the first two. And it is, on the website, says it's the continuation from Monkey Island 2. So, yeah. Oh, there's five? Only four on Steam. So yeah, maybe. Telltale did a Monkey's Island? Really? Like, in the Telltale style? That's interesting. Hmm. One pirate version? I thought maybe it would be on like GOG or something. To be honest, like, for me, I get, like, the remaster really helps. Like, having it all, having it all voice acted is, like, really a big deal to me. Because it would get very tiring. And, uh, I find... At least for me, I find that uh, the puzzle solving, it can be uh, tiring, like very tiring. And then you're like trying to have it an intelligible, I didn't say intelligent, intelligible chat with chat. And uh, yeah, it can be tiring. So that's why I wanted to take the food break. <laughs> 
and get some fuel, you know? Speaking of dogs, you were talking about Walter's barking. I left a comment on the Last of Us third stream. It's a bit longer, but might help you out with that. Oh, can you, like, just tweet that to me or something? Like, it would be really hard for me to find it. I would, I'd be open to trying a lot of stuff with Walty, because... There's two things with Walter that he really struggles with. And he's come a long way. Like, if, if, you, if, if I could show you Walter at nine months, ten months old to where he is now, you'd be like, oh, wow, that's not even the same dog in terms of um, behaviors and stuff. So we've been able to work through quite a few things. But he still gets... He's very reactive to other dogs. So if you're walking him and other dogs across the street... He wants to just go, and he makes these sounds like... I think it's like a lack of confidence. Because he just loses it. Like, the dog's just walking casually, and he just wants to go and battle. <laughs> I'm like, dude, you will lose. And then, uh, dogs on TV. Just loses it. Yeah, he definitely has anxiety, Eva. So, yeah, could you, like... If you could tweet it to me or send it to me on Discord, that would be way easier for me to find it. Needs to learn non-aggressive body language. Yeah. Yeah, if you have advice for that, I would love to hear it. I'm not I'm not personally equipped with the knowledge to get that done. And we did work with a really good trainer, and she taught us a lot of great stuff. But the big challenge is that I don't want to put him in a position to f to fail, and it's really hard to do that, I find. And I think that's what I struggle with, because I want to take him on walks to, like, desensitize him and be able to reward him when he sees another dog at a distance that he won't freak out. And he gets that reward, and he's like, okay, cool, and then progressively work towards being closer and closer kind of thing. Um, but it's not super practical all the time because, you know, you turn a corner and, oh, shit, there's a dog there. Like, situations happen, right? So. <laughs> Ludwig says, my dog is anxious around little girls but horny for men in hats. <laughs> That's funny. Hey, Moojis. Watch my Horizon Zero Dawn video right now? Sick. Thanks. Dog part? I'm, I'm super anti-dog part, especially with an anxious dog. There's a, a good argument to be made for going to, like, the outside of a fence on dog parks, because you can guarantee you'll find dogs there. And then you could train, like, some, um, you know, some desensitization to, like... When the dogs are far away, you can be rewarding and getting him to, like, say, like, okay, these dogs are cool, right? But I definitely wouldn't take him in the dog park. Yeah. And, like, not to generalize, because not everybody's this way, but people at the dog parks are generally, like, oh, yeah, my dog's totally fine. Like, that's fine, but... The issue is you don't, you know your own dog and you know yourself. You don't know the other person and you don't know what their dog is like, regardless of what the person says. So. Yeah. Just gotta have patience and give calm, consistent correction when the dog misbehaves. Yeah, I, I like that's the key. It's just, uh, you know, dog training is one of those things that's so much like if there's anything in the world that's easier said than done it's dog training and not training to like sit but like correcting something that is innate in that dog for whatever reason is seems super challenging are we thinking about getting another dog no mm -mm. We had two dogs when Dexter was older, and then Walter joined the picture, and that was great. 
I'm super happy with that. I, I firmly believe that it added years to Dexter's life and, uh, and like, gave him a higher quality of life having Walter around. Uh, but just because of the way that Walty is, he's like, uh, he needs our full attention. And I don't think it would be a good idea to introduce another dog until we can kind of work through what he's currently working on. You know what I'm saying? Thanks, Eva. Oh, are you uh, Terra? Oh yeah, here. Okay, sick. Yeah, I'm gonna read this um, after the stream. Thank you. I'm going for a dog park. It's a big one, and Soka always gets along with the other dogs. Only once some big dogs gave her some trouble. Yeah. My dog would be chill until an unleashed dog came up to her, then she'd be threatened and bark and growl, never bite. Because she was a staffy, the other owners would freak. Yeah. I'm almost done. And then we're gonna go again. The thing is, he gets along uh, really well <laughs> with his sister. Friends of ours. Got his sister from the same litter. And, uh... We try to get them together, like, once a week. Even them! Actually, for the first, like... I would say... Year and a half? Of them kind of growing up together? When they would play, it would literally be non-stop. Like, just insane, like, balls to the walls playing for... Like, hours, it seemed. And now they're kind of like... They get together, they'll play for a bit, they'll go outside, they'll play for a bit, whatever. And then they, they start kind of being like, whatever. They start to not even care that the other is there. I actually need him to do that with every other dog. You want to see the other graphics for him? <laughs> it's all jacket, man. Are you banned? No, I don't think so. You're not banned, Spooky. Do you want to be? I thought about another dog because my one seems rather bored or lonely when I'm away. I will say this. Um, everyone's situation is different. I loved having two dogs, but... Training the new dog while the other dog is around is very hard. And just having two dogs that aren't, you know, that have two different sets of needs. It's like having kids, right? A lot of people say, like, having, you know, your second kid is easier. Yes, because you have the knowledge of what you learned from having the first kid. But you're adding another kid or another dog, and it's a lot. It's a lot of extra time and uh, responsibility. Okay, are you guys ready? Let's dive back in. Okay. Uh, something more built to last. Something not too expensive, but built to last. Affordable quality. Hey, that's my motto. I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. Trying to say that even the actor now, that plays Guybrush Throughput admits no to taking 24 kind of to 48 hours to complete the game. I can games. also tell that quality means a lot to that. you. I mean, just look at the way you dress. Rugged, like this baby. She comes from a land far to the north. Canada. The sea is as unforgiving as the men are tough. And <laughs> hey, you wouldn't happen to be from there, would you? You just seem to have a sort of Nordic quality about you. Anyway, we're talking about a real value here. How much would you like to spend? 
No more than 173 pieces of eight again. I have 371 pieces of eight. Okay, this is a weird glitch. I'm glad this ship doesn't have ears, my friend. Because if she did, she'd slap your face. What's I weird about it? the cash for this transaction either. You do have some other means of payment, don't you? What's weird about it is that it's voice acted. And it almost makes me think that they got the recordings, the voice actor said it wrong, but it wasn't caught. And then somebody caught it like late and just was like, well, we got to put the subtitles as that. Pretty sure it's him lying. It, that would be a really weird uh, coincidence because it's like reversed, right? On second thought, this may not be the ship for me. Okay, but I got five other guys coming back to look at this baby today. Don't count on it. His words, not mine. When you think that it's six hours, he he he. How? So go to um. Can I show you? Go to the website HLTB. How long to beat? It's usually pretty bang on for how long games are. It's good estimates. Um, let's see. I'll just tell him I don't have much to spend. I don't really have that much to spend. Have no fear. Can I take the Every boat that's capsized? Is a bargain. But if you're looking for a real steal, I've got just the boat for you. Okay, now Walk we're talking. This way. Give me the as is. Oh, you're gonna give me this one? This here is the famous Sea Monkey, the only ship ever to make it to Monkey Island and come back with anyone aboard left alive. Or should I say, anything? <laughs> you see, the previous owners of the ship were two adventurous pirates. They set off, like many before, to find the legendary secret of Monkey Island. And like many before, they disappeared forever. Their fate, a mystery. Almost as mysterious as how this ship returned to Melee Island without a single human aboard. Some claim it was sailed back by a crew of chimps. Chimps? Sus. There aren't any chimps in the Caribbean. Oh, shut up. It makes a good story. <laughs> anyway, this baby's mine now. That oh, is, until someone makes funny. me an offer. How much would you like to spend? Let's see what he says. I have 371 pieces of eight. Look, this is a very reasonably priced ship, but not that reasonable. I don't think you've got the cash for this transaction either. You do have some other means of payment, don't you? On second thought, this may not be the ship for me. Well, heck, I can understand that. Nothing wrong with being indecisive, even if it is a waste of my time. So, what else can I show you? Uh, let's talk about the spiffy blue one. That spiffy blue one by your office looks nice. Of course it does. It's mine. And it's not for sale. What oh, the 371-173 was, was messed up in the original too. Oh... So they, it's just like a, it's like inside baseball joke. Love that. That's cool. Actually, I'd like to go think about it some more. Sure, sure. Think it over. Okay, I so want you to feel we got nowhere. Or anything. Bye now. We got nowhere. I need a job and credit or something. Can we go inside his office maybe? Steal a key? I forgot to give what you my fuck? card. <laughs> and here's something else to remember me by. <laughs> Yeah. Uh -huh. A compass? Oh. An extra strong magnetic compass. Magnet. With your picture on it. That's right. It always points directly back here. So if you're looking for a good deal, you know where to go. I'll be right here when you come back. But I can't guarantee that any of these ships will. Right. They're moving fast today. Yes, sir. Just like my Can't hands. Really keep anything in stock. He'll be back. <laughs> I love sometimes when they turn to the camera. Okay, so we got a bunch of stuff there. Uh, should I go back to this guy? 
Whose house was this again? Oh yeah, the training. Let's just double check to see if there's anything we could do here. There's no answer. Okay, so we're never coming back. Excellent. We could go talk to uh, Muscle Chrome Dome, dude. Maybe? Because there's really, like... There's him. There's, uh... There's the prisoner, I guess, maybe? And there's the shopkeeper that I feel like was referenced with, uh... The salesman. Okay, let's look at these items as well. Business card. Stan's previously owned vessels. I won't shut up until I've made you a deal. Stan. Yeah, see, I think what happens is when you look at this, your inventory closes. So if you do something, and like, you may not see the change. Maybe something happens in the top right, but... When you set sail for good value, all winds blow <laughs> towards stands. Warning. Contains strong magnet, which may interfere with other navigational equipment. Yeah, so the magnet, obviously, is key. For what? Don't know yet. Stan said the shopkeeper can extend you a line of credit if you have a job. Yeah, there you go. So what kind of job could I get? That's the question. Maybe that maybe I could go back to the circus or something. Um, maybe I can get a job from this guy. Maybe I could get a job with those sketchy dudes on the street. Maybe the maybe the bar guy. We got a lot of. I told you, I don't have the time to show you any more tattoo tricks. And, like, he's got that little switch over there that I've been eyeing up ever since we got here. Oh, this is good. Now I got something new for him. He's got the chest up top. Okay. Uh, governor's been kidnapped. The governor's been kidnapped! This is good. What? That's preposterous. Oh, really? Take a look at this note they left. Oh, no. This is horrible. What are we going to do? I was hoping you would have an idea. Uh, I was hoping you would have an idea. Hmm. Let me think. Hmm. Yes, thinking. Oh, no. Thinking sounds. We could get a ship and a crew and go rescue her. What an idea. Hey, Simon. Thanks, man. Uh, thanks for the 16 months, dude. only had a captain. Well, what about me? Ha! You? <laughs> That's a good one. Hey, I'm serious. Really? Really? Okay, let's see you prove it. Walk this way. We're in. There's something in here that I want to show you. Something horrible. Something so horrible that I stay awake at night just thinking about it. But I don't mean to scare you. I'm sure a big brave guy like yourself will have no problem facing this monster. After all, it's much smaller than the beast that bit off my hands so many years ago. Arr, 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 arr. Let's just hope you're quicker than I was. Oh, I just remembered something. I never did get around to feeding him this week. Ha 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 ha! Silly me! I'll let you open this last door yourself. Just let me get out of your way. Wait. <laughs> Getting cold feet? No, I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> yeah. You're supposed to open that little door. Sure. And if you're brave enough, touch the beast inside. Oh, is that all? It's a wiener reference, I think. Can't be sure. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> if you've got the guts. Is there anything else I can mess with? Thank you. 
That's a cool shot. It's a murderous winged devil. Whoa, I got a whole bunch of new toys. Let's tickle them. <laughs> That's so me. weird that that screen is different for that. You are a brave man. I was thinking I'm going to like pick it up. You faced the beast I've feared all these years. You had the guts to do what I never could. Is this to like earn his trust so I we could be his captain? Like such a coward. I'm not good enough to be on your crew. Okay. I'm not even good enough to swab your de 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 eggs. Oh, come on, Meat Hook. You're a big, strong, good-looking guy with a talking tattoo. You can swab my decks anytime. God. <laughs> so hot. Really? Sure. I can still be on your crew. Just pack your stuff and meet me at the dock. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you. I won't let you down. Okay, my man. He's definitely got some... He's definitely got some emotional hey, problems. Maybe I'll get a chance to show you my whole tattoo routine. Oh, yeah, I'd love that. Love that. Wow, this is sounding better and better all the time. <laughs> okay. That was pretty easy. Ahoy there, Captain. What are you doing back here so soon? Oh, just curious. You didn't think I was chickening out, did you? Uh... <laughs> no, of course not. I just wanted to tell you that uh, everything's a-okay. <laughs> hey, that's great. So I guess I'll see you at the dock, right? Right. See you there. Okay, bye. Just, yeah, everything's confirmed. Let's go. Let's go. Whip out my chicken. Wah, 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 wah. Are they- I don't even- to be honest, David, I don't know if these are, like, I don't know if these are adult jokes or not. I think I'm just 12 years old, you know what I mean? I- but I could be wrong. Are they written to have, like, uh, innuendos? Wouldn't surprise me based on some of the- some of the, uh, writing that we've seen, but- Oh, here we go. Meanwhile, having just returned from melee, LeChuck and his crew find their old hiding place in the underground rivers of Monkey Island and drop anchor. Captain, sir, I just stopped by to congratulate you on your kidnapping mission. Captain? Captain, are you all right? So, was he the we guy the whole weapon. time? And how fair is our prisoner? Or did he like shape shift? Ah, yes, the uh, prisoner. <laughs> we what? had a little trouble. Trouble! No, 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 nothing to worry about, sir. Everything's under control. She escaped a few times, but we've got her locked up in the brig. I wonder if there were any no hints at that. Or out of there. For your sake, I hope not. With years of almost destroyed by my death, I'm not taking any chances now. They said that new the sheriff is new and the old one died in mysterious Guy circumstances. Brush Threepwood will not be a problem. At this very moment, he's twenty feet underwater. Probably bloated up like a fattened pig. His eyes being eaten out by crabs. Fish pecking at his fingers. Kinda makes you wish you were there to watch. Ah, yes sir. <laughs> sure does it that. Now, go check on the route. Make sure it's locked up. 
tight. Aye, aye, Captain. You think the special edition graphics are a travesty? How? How could you objectively think that? I think it's super good. <laughs> Look at this. You're a you're six pixels, eight maximum, and now you're like a whole ass character. I don't know. I I totally get like uh, some people. You know, you play like the original, and it'll, nothing will ever be as good. You know, because. You, ha you look at it a certain way, and, uh, I respect that. But I don't think you could, I don't think objectively you could say that these are a travesty, you know? I think they've done a super nice job. Okay, let's go to, not there. Let's go to, uh, Buddy Boy with the safe and see if we could maybe get a job. And then we'll start figuring things out from here. I've got my eye on you, boy. Yeah, yeah, Steal Grandpa. anything and I break your legs. What do you want? I need a note of credit. I'm interested in procuring a note of credit. You are, I, uh, you got a job. It's not 4K? Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, yeah, it is. Um, yeah, no, I'm not employed. To be honest, sir? I'm not. I am not I would employed. love to be. Oh, thank you for telling me that. I respect your honesty. He's gonna kick me out. But I didn't get to be 83 by being no jackass. <laughs> no job, no credit. <laughs> Come back when you got one. Shit. What else do you want? I need a job. I think I'd just like to browse. Whatever. Okay. I don't know if they told us who I could get a job from. I did talk about a couple of potential options. We could do something sketchy with these guys, maybe. It's worth a shot. Uh, we'll try and talk to her again. Oh. Did you know the governor's been kidnapped? Uh, well, <laughs> They're really yes, keeping up with the times. Knew about that. Oh, here we go. We can recruit them for our boat. Can I interest you in a dream vacation to Monkey Island? I need workers. Because of this sudden change in local government, I'm prepared to offer you a once-in-a-lifetime price on a cruise to that scenic wonderland, Monkey Island. Come on, baby. And the amazing thing Join. about this offer is the price. Mm -hmm. Absolutely free. All you have to do is help me crew the ship, and Island Paradise can be yours. Free. And we might just rescue the governor while we're at it. Uh, well, the governor can probably take care of herself. And we are sort of busy here. Yeah. And we've got the circus to think of. We've got to find the elephant. Find the rat. Yeah. And get rid of these minutes. I'm sorry. We simply can't go at this time. Okay, so we need to get their rat back. We haven't seen an elephant, but we do know where the circus is. But when we went back last time, we couldn't go back into the circus. Excuse me, but do... Oh, it's only you again. I told you there was only one in existence. Now get lost. Anyone ever play Myst? Uh, I tried playing Myst when I was younger, and it was too confusing <laughs> for me. Okay, we'll give this another go. Hello. Nope, not happening. Oh shit! Yikes. Okay. So you have returned to learn future. This is good. Yes, I must go after the governor. I see you with some others willing to help in your cause. I really hate Give me something that important, ma'am. Makes me see spots. Quiet. I am getting another vision. You must. Must what? 
You must go to Monkey Island. Yeah. Once there, obviously, you will search for the ghost pirate LeChuck. He hides deep, deep beneath Monkey Island. There is only one thing powerful enough to destroy LeChuck. What? It's an ancient root. Once prepared, the root can destroy a ghost with one touch. Yeah. I'm getting more. More vision. Spill it! I see the cannibals that live on the island. They are helping you or eating Cannibals, you. good. I can't tell. The vision isn't coming in clear anymore. Or not. <laughs> Great. Now go and find the one that loves you. Oh. But be warned. Don't worry. I'll watch out for LeChuck. Not of LeChuck, of yourself. What you will find out about yourself and your world, it will terrify you. Yeah, welcome back, Fabio. Okay, well, that was... That was something, I guess. Okay. Okay, okay. Let me just let me just pop into the church here. It's weird that there's a church and there's literally nothing to do. All right. Still nothing. Oh. Hello. We have a guard here. May I help you? I was just on my way to the governor's. I'm mansion. guessing we have no access there now. Are you here for the looting? <laughs> um <laughs> Maybe? Yes, looting sounds like fun now that I'm a pirate and all. And do you have reservations, sir? Oh, of course. Why, yes, I do have reservations. And what name would they be under? Mm, S for Shine Top. It's probably under S for Shine Top. Nice try. <laughs> Damn it. But. We're booked solid for the next five hours. Mm, but I might be able to squeeze you in around Sexual the two o'clock hour. Would that be okay? I guess so. Yes, that would be fine. Super. I'll put you down for <laughs> one to loot the governor's mansion at 2.30. Respect. Respect. Okay, what else do I have in here? The file is gone. See, one thing I thought was maybe, maybe I could fill one of these things with the uh, grog stuff. And since it melts the cup, maybe it would melt the bars? Looks like a fine pewter tankard. Is that, is that unreasonable? The governor's been kidnapped. What? What? Here, look at this note. They kidnapped the governor? That really makes me mad. <laughs> oh, I feel like kicking someone. Hmm. I wonder if she left her place unlocked. The problem is, I don't know if we could make it all the way. That's the thing. If I let you out, would you join my crew? Sure. Of course. To my emancipator, I shall be eternally indebted. Until then, I pace. <laughs> it's worth a shot. We'll try it. Because I don't really have any other options. It still doesn't get me a job. So, that's a bit worrying. Uh, what's the teleport to the other side here? This one. Look how much time this saves us. Wow. Wow. We also have a uh, lighthouse guy, maybe? Oh, they replenished the cups. Interesting. 
<laughs> okay, let's give it a try. Use this here. Run. Run, 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 run. <laughs> Look at. Wait, what? <laughs> Looks like a fine pewter tanker. Why is this down there? Oh, the look at is just popping because of other stuff. It's kind of... Oh, see? Now it's melting. Uh, this is not great. And it's gone. Okay. Okay. Great. Uh... What a priceless Ming. Okay, hold on. Maybe I can put maybe I can put it in the Ming. Maybe I can put it in the Ming. It's possible that it's a, like a speed thing, but I feel like I don't know how much faster I could have done that. Ah! Fabio, thank you so much, man. I appreciate the support, dude. Thanks. <laughs> oh, another thing we could do. Uh, I bet you. Okay. Okay, I got it. I got it, chat. I got it. I got it. I got this. That's why we have five mugs. Okay? We got five mugs, so I could probably pour it between the mugs. Am I wrong? Don't tell me, but I'm pretty sure that's what I'm going to do. Uh, let's just try this, just in case. Holy shit, that wow. actually worked. It ate the thing right up. Oh, great. Okay. <laughs> uh, didn't want that anyway. So now, let me just see here. Let's say I'm going to use mug with mug. Okay. We got it. I, I was wondering, like, why are we getting five of these suckers? I can even pick this one up. Okay. Once we go through here, we'll do a transfer. Use this on this. Very good, Christopher. Very good. Very nice. I'm not gonna take any chances here. Let's go. Am I not see anything special about it? A drink! I'm real thirsty. Yikes! Nice. Wow. And to think I Some used things to they just click. Stuff. Sometimes I'm they just free. don't. Now, oh, yeah. I'll probably have to do that again to get the rat out, don't Sucker. I? Sucker! Oh, this. Are you serious, bro? <laughs> but. Really? Do we still have a deal? I'm sure he'll be back. <laughs> Yeah. He gave me his word as a pirate. I'm sure. I think it's welded shut now. Oh. I can't move it. I can't move it. Okay. Now, I guess let me let me see if I can go Should I do that again for the rat? Oh, you know what? If I was that sketchy dude, I'm going to check that back alley real quick. Just, just to see. Just to see. No. 
He's not here. Okay. Never played this game either and have always wanted to. How are you finding it? It's really good. It's uh, The writing is really fun. And, uh, and the puzzles are mostly really good. So, yeah, I'm digging it. If we go in here and there's more mugs, I'm going to say that, yes. Okay. I'm going to say that's a pretty good hint. And then we could get the rat out the same way. Okay, motor time. <laughs> you have bad memories in that back alley? What were you doing back there? We only have one memory there. Okay, so we're going to free the rat, which hopefully gets those guys to join our boat, I guess? This better work. That doesn't seem to work. What? Mm-hmm. But wait. Oh, okay. It only welds shut when we close it. Totally. Okay, now I have like a bunch of mugs. That's fun. Let's go talk to the street guys. The guys with low moral fiber. Oh, the rat didn't come back. I'll just be okay. running along now. Maybe the rat went to the circus then, because they were talking about the rat with the elephant, but we never saw an elephant there. That doesn't seem to work. But... That's the only connection I have to the rat. Watch the rat's going to be in that freaking alley the whole time. And I'm just like... that Because a rat would be in an alley. Those crazy spaghetti brothers are still in there. Those crazy spaghetti brothers are still in there. Luke says back alley. God damn it. I was right. Luke? Just couldn't hold back, hey? Just couldn't do it. It's okay, we're on the right track. <coughs> elephant mouth trope is common. Yeah, they always say, like, elephants are scared of, like, mice and rats and stuff. Because they're so big and the other ones are so small. Alas, here, the circus was not correct. Are elephants afraid of mice? I don't know if that's actually real. I, I don't know. Oh, okay. He's not here. Is he? Oh, this does say... Employees only. Oh, shit. Now I don't know where the rat would have went. Oh, a circus! I love a circus! We know. Luke! 
I was thinking because we need to become an employee that we had this sign, but the front of this is here. But there's nothing to do in here? Rat also not in here. You need to find people for your crew. Really? Really? Um... Okay. Might not say anything special about it. I think it's welded shut now. Okay, so the prison, there's nothing happening anymore. This guy won't let me through. Nothing in the church, nothing in the alley. Do I have anything that could, like, attract a rat? Oh, I do. Potentially. Meat. Right? But I don't, I don't have anything to interact with back here. That's the problem. Talk to NPCs? Well, didn't I... Haven't I talked to them all, Blazer? That guy we set an appointment with. The guy in the shop told me to get a job. These guys talked about joining, but they wanted to have their rat, just so they won't talk now. now. Uh, oh, did I miss this guy? I may have missed this guy. But I don't Excuse think I did. Me, but the... Now it's only you again. I told you there was only one in existence. Now get lost. Okay. I did say maybe we need to talk to the lighthouse guy. Since he's responsible for watching everything, maybe he saw something about the rat. Scumbar guy doesn't want to help us. I think until we get the crew together, I'm not going to worry about the boat. Let's talk to him. Any sign of the governor? None. As I said, I fear we've seen the last of her. Okay. Okay. Maybe the swordmaster? But she went into her house, so I don't know if she's reachable. <clears throat> Did we loot the shopkeeper's shop? Um, we didn't. He still has, like, a safe there. So maybe she's gonna join us. You've already got the t-shirt. What do you want now? I want you to join my crew. The governor's been kidnapped! Okay, this is good. What? That's ridiculous. Oh, no. This looks bad. Very bad. I'm getting a ship and a crew together to go rescue her. Hmm. I have a feeling I'm going to regret this, but count me in. I'll meet you at the dock. Okay. Anybody else? I think no. We could try just checking in at the docks. What was this place? Yeah, we need the ship, of course, which is going to be at the docks. <laughs> Maybe the rat is just part of our crew? This guy's going to meet us at the docks, right? Okay, cool, cool, cool. Or I guess the dock could be in the village as well. But I, f I feel like we're taken off from the Emporium. Howdy! Great to see you again. I knew you'd come back. Everybody does. The problem is, we you don't have a job. why they come back? 
Just look at all these ships. I've got something for everyone. Come, take a look around. No, they're not here. So, what else can Kay. I show you? Actually, I'd like to go think about it some more. Sure, I'm gonna sure, go. I can't remember over. who's at that I don't house on the right of the map. Or anything. Bye now. Bing, bing, bing. Did I already give you my car? You sure did. Here. I'd better give you another one just in case. Great. Thanks. That's excellent. You do have a job. Remember you tested the cannon? Well, I thought about the circus, but like, every time I've gone back there... Oh yeah, this is a sword training house. I always forget that. There's no answer. Whenever I go back there, I can't seem to get in there. <laughs> if I can't get into the circus, I'll, I'll take a hint system here and we'll see what happens. This looks like a sneaky little path, doesn't it? Those crazy spaghetti brothers are still in there. Those crazy spaghetti brothers are still in there. I think there's something going on in there. Is there like a verb I need to use here? It doesn't seem to open. I can't move it. I can't move it. Okay, we know that. We know that, but he wants us to have a job. Do I, do I just need to... Maybe... <laughs> Maybe. Do I just need to tell him that I had a job? <laughs> Is that the... <sighs> Why? I'm just trying to be honest here. And I'm getting punished. I just need to tell him I have a job. Right? That's it. Son of a bitch. Nice guys finish last, I'll tell you. It's classic. I've got my eye on you, boy. Steal anything and I break your legs. What do you want? I'm interested in procuring a note of credit. You got yourself a job, finally, huh? Oh, definitely. All right. I'll get one of my notes and we'll fill it out. I didn't even mean to say shit. Oh, pay attention. Is he going in there? Let's see here. What did you that say? That was your very, occupation was? very fast. I'm an acrobat with a traveling circus. You're one of them fettuccine brothers? Yeah. Where's your silly accent? And where are your silly slippers? Come back when you got a job in a credible business. Okay. Okay, I gotta watch this again. Yeah, I'm going to show you what I have written. I'm going to show you what I have written, but I, in my brain, this makes sense. Okay, check those out. What else do you want? This is going to work. I'm looking for I the need him to go see Island. the sword person again. Yeah, like I'm going to fall for that one again. Oh, please. I won't steal anything this time, I promise. 
Hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there. Again. Be right back. <laughs> I've got my eyes on you, weasel boy. Don't try anything. I hope you do, old man. Okay. So I need to go left, down, right. Down, left. Down, right, up, left. Up, right, down. Easy. Okay. <laughs> I have to just do it. Uh, so we're going to... Pull. Pull. And I guess pull again. We'll go this way. Yeah. Then I need to go... Uh, hold on. Down left. So I'm going to push. Okay. Then I need to go... Down. Oh, fuck. I think I screwed it up. Okay, I need to reset it. Okay. Okay. Uh, left. Down. Right. Uh... Up. Left. Hold on. No. I screwed that up. Okay, hold on. I think I had it the first time. Left. Down. Right. Down. Left. Then I need to go the other way. Yeah. Down. Right. Up. Left. And then I need it to go the other way. Up, right, down. But that's no. it's very confusing with the push pull but let's get the hell out of here that's very very confusing i the good and honorable storekeeper do hereby take liability for the debts of the bearer of this note for any amount up to five thousand pieces of eight wow that guy is going to be pissed when he finds out what we've done too bad for him. Too bad for him. I'll give these guys one more chance. All right. I'll just be running along now. See you later, suckers. <clears throat> Great success. I think, with any luck, we're out of here. What's happened to the rat, I wonder? Might be a mystery we never solve. Is this remastered? Yes. Yeah. Here's the old version. Here's the new Howdy. version. Howdy! Again? I knew you'd come back. Everybody does. I really you wish you could skip they this. Come back? Just look at... 
skip cutscene. Subtitle speed in classic. All these ships. I've got something for everyone. Come, take a look around. No. Yeah, so maybe using the hotkeys for push and pull would be easier. You. Uh, could I see that red one again? I knew it. I knew it. Just can't get her out of your mind. Yeah, the can dot you? doesn't do it anymore. Walk this way. Now here's a ship that's definitely worth a second look. Let's talk about money. Your money. I think I want this ship here, right? I got credit from the storekeeper. Will you take it? I'd love to. I really would. I usually do, but not for the amount this baby's gonna run you. What? Maybe one of the other ships would be more in your price range. So, what else can I show you? Are we getting a junker? Uh, could I see the cheap one again? Sure, sure. You're obviously an educated guy who wants to make an educated decision. Walk this way. Okay, the big one is the cheap one. Hard to stay away from a good mystery, isn't it? Hmm? This is what I How want. How much would you like to spend? I got credit from the storekeeper. Will you take it? Hey, of course. Your credit's always good at stands. It doesn't matter if you've had credit problems in the past. Divorce, chronic gambling mishaps. I mean, who am I to judge, right? If the storekeeper trusts you enough to give you a letter of credit, then you must be an honest man with a steady income, right? Uh, right. Let's get down to brass tack, shall we? I know you want it. You know you want it. God, I hate and that. I eh? know that you know that I want to sell it, so... Let's talk extras. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? I'd like to pay 2,000 pieces of eight. Sure. I guess we can start out at the Let's bottom. see his negotiating skills here. All day. I'm going to be getting a whole new shipment next week. So you got me over a barrel. I've got to sell this baby, even if it means losing my shirt. Let's talk extras. Extras? You want to talk extras? Great! This baby's loaded with extras. For instance, did I tell you about the porthole defogger? Oh, I love a porthole defogger. Geez, Stan, that does sound useful. And well worth the money, too. That's why it's Our already car salesman always is the price. But wait, there's more. Not always. But lock anchor. Some are. Geez, Stan, that does sound useful. And well worth the money, too. That's why it's already included in the price. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the rack and pinion rudder? Geez, Stan, that we'll does take sound it useful. all, Stan. And well worth the money too. That's why it's already included in the price. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the velour sail covers? Geez, Stan, that does sound useful. And well worth the money too. That's why it's already included in the price. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the taco meter? Jesus, I just want it already. Enough about extras already. Okay, where were we? <laughs> I'll just give you everything I have. Well, what do you think it's worth? 
to stop. You could sail this puppy away today for just oh, 10,000 pieces of eight. How does that sound to you? Sounds not good. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. We're getting fleeced, guys. How We're getting much? fleeced. All right, 5,000, but that's my final offer. That's a little bit more like it, but not much. Huh? I know you can try harder than that. Bro, I literally can't. What would it take to get you to sail this ship away today? I gotta be willing to walk away. Forget it. I don't need this boat anyway. Now, wait a second. Don't go away mad. I'm sure we can work something out. That's how it's done. Sorry, Stan. I'm out of here. Sure, sure. Think it over. I don't want you to feel pressured or anything. Bye now. No! Is he really letting me go? He's gonna stop me, right? He's gotta. I forgot to give oh, you my card. My I'll be right here God. when you come back. But I can't guarantee that any of these ships will. Right. They're moving fast today. So now yes I gotta go back to them? Can't hardly keep anything in stock. He'll be back. You're right. I will be back. Howdy. <laughs> oh, God. I just knew you'd be back. I knew you wouldn't be able to Kill get me. that little beauty out of your mind. Come on, let's go take another look at her. <laughs> that is true, though, in negotiating. You let's have to be willing to, to walk away. Track, like, literally. It has to be like a... Don't you, that they just don't if you want a better like price, you have to be willing to not get the object. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? He's in every game? Oh, that's sick. Five thousand. And that's my final final offer. Final but final. Still not enough money. Inflation works in the other direction, you know? Buddy, you can tell me the truth. It's the little woman, isn't it? You're afraid I think I of technically have five thousand one hundred and seventy-three dollars. Or Don't pieces of be eight. such a wimp. Stand up to her. She'll respect you for it. And when she sees this ship, she'll love you for it. Trust me. Okay. Clearly our approach isn't working. Let's talk extras. Let's, we'll tell him. tell you about the taco meter? We don't need the extra shit. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Wow, does your wife know you're such a <laughs> cheapskate? But wait, Bro. there's more. Did I tell you about the elevator made with wood from burgundy wine casks? Because we have to artificially bring down the value of what he's propositioning. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. That's all I can think of. Yeah, I guess that is kind of decadent, isn't it? But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about this simulated wood siding? I hope this works. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Okay, but I'm telling you, barnacles hate simulated wood. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the porthole defoggers? You did. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Okay, but don't blame me if you run into an iceberg or something. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the anti-lock anchor? Does he still say 10k if you ask? I don't know. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Sure, throw safety to the wind. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the rack and pinion rudder? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Well, I guess it'll float without it. Barely. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the velour sail covers? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. 
Hey, travel light. I can understand that, sure. Of course, mutiny is an ugly word. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the taco meter? Okay, I'm pretty sure now we're going in circles. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Wow. Does your wife know yeah. you're such a okay. cheap Okay, so I'm going to go to the cash. Wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the elevator made with wood from burgundy <laughs> wine casks? Enough about extras already. Okay, where were we? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? I'd like to pay 2,000 pieces of eight. The I only thing I can think of is wrong direction I either like spam low prices or I that. try to walk away and understand. then go back to them. I thought you were interested in this ship. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? I'd still like to pay 2000 <laughs> That's still not enough money. Oh Inflation works in the other direction, you know. I'd let you take it out for a little spin around the harbor, but our insurance company won't let us. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? Let's try five. All right, 5,000, but that's my final offer. 5,000 pieces of eight. This is good. Okay, okay. Thank it's Christ. Me, but okay. Okay. And I thought I was going to give my children Christmas presents this year. Oh my God. Just take it out of here. Jeez. I'm glad to get rid of it. I'm glad to get rid of you. Oh, yeah. Do you have that note from the storekeeper on you? Thanks. I've got to run these numbers by my boss. He'll think I'm nuts, but I'll talk him into it. You meet me at the Isn't dock he the with boss? your crew. I'll bring the ship and the papers. I just want to say that I really feel like we got to know each other today. Oh, yeah, I we mean, did. I really felt some bonding here. And mm -hmm. I don't just say that to everybody. It's been great doing business with you. Really? Because <laughs> that walk is so good. See you at the dock, and don't forget your crew. All three of them. It may not look like much, but it's mine. Okay, so I guess the dock is going to be um, near the village. Let's go. I hope. Time for Act hey, Three. It's a good Did I go through Act Two? Up. Was Act Two like after the? To uh, buy this baby off me while I've been standing here waiting for you. After we stole the thing. But I said no way. I know a guy who's in love with this ship, and it would break his heart to lose it. Am I right? Of course I am. I mean, just yeah, look I at thought, her. Yeah, I thought we were still in Act One. Aerodynamic, a buoyant barnacle-covered beauty. I think we're having a real moment here. <laughs> I could feel it. I've changed my mind. I can't give her up. You can have your money back. How could I sell something so dear? Then again, a deal's <laughs> a deal, right? Right. <laughs> Whoops, I almost forgot to give you this free seafaring <laughs> literature. My gift to you. Just remember where you got it. Stands. How could I forget? Maybe I should have gotten that extended warranty after all. Hey, long time no see. Hey, he came. 
Have you come to be on my crew? Hey, I could never pass up a chance to make some easy money. Uh, money? Yeah, we are getting paid for this, right? My question is, guys, what happened to the rat? Okay? Glad you could make it, Carl. Where is the rat? Disappeared. Look, gone forever. Don't start with What was me, the point? Okay? Why'd I do that? So what's that waterlogged wreck doing out there? How are we gonna get our ship in here with that pile of scrap in the way? That's... Nah. Where's the cabin boy? I need him to go back to my place and pick up my bags. What's going on here? Where's our ship? You think Where's the rat's living crew? his? Did he go? Did the rat this go to live on a farm? This isn't gonna be as easy as Is I that thought. What happened? Part two, the journey. <laughs> Even the titles. <laughs> That's amazing. That is so Through cool that the they courageous added that. leadership of Captain Free uh, Threepwood, the Sea Monkey is finally underway. Undaunted by their lack of navigational equipment or expertise, the crew begins to plan their voyage. First of all, I'd like to say it's great to be working with such a fine crew. The voyage ahead is not going to be easy. It's going to take skill, endurance, and most of all, teamwork. First, I thought we'd assign some duties. What is it we were suckered into doing again? Oh, uh, you're lucky to be doing this, bro. I made a list. Suckered is right. I don't see what the big deal is with rescuing the governor. She can clearly take care of herself. The way I look at it, we got this great ship. Well, we got a ship. <laughs> Why don't we kick back, tie a rope to the wheel, and cruise for a while? I could use a little work on my tan. Come to think of it, I have been a little stressed out lately. I could use a rest. Then it's decided. We cruise the Caribbean. Uh... Okay, I ladies do. and gentlemen. I think we're going to wrap it up here for today. 25% complete? That has to be bullshit. Right? Has to be. Oh, look. We're 35% now. Okay. We're going to be back tomorrow. Uh, we're going to be back tomorrow. I'll schedule the stream... Probably be starting a bit earlier than uh, than I did today. Oh, tired. That was fun. I really like it. I'm really having a good time with this. Hopefully, now that I've got a sense for how the uh, puzzles are, I, I I hope this doesn't take us another ten hours. Uh, but I'll finish it tomorrow. Either way. And, uh, and that's it. Yeah, we're going to finish it tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. Fun, fun, fun times. Thank you guys so much for coming. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow. And then after that, we're going to move into Monkey Island 2 over the course of uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And then Monday, we'll play uh, the brand new release. Looking forward to that as well. So, good times. We're not playing uh, Curse or the other one. We're only going to play the, the two remastered and then go into the new release on Monday. So, yeah. Full Throttle. Loved, loved Full Throttle. I think I did a one-off video on Full Throttle on my channel, actually, too. So, check that out. Well, guys, have a good one. Thanks so much for coming and thanks for uh, being cool.